everybody welcome to definitely not fried chicken the 1.0 release um it's here <laughs> 1.0 is here if you have been a long time subscriber of the channel you know that in the past i have played definitely not fried chicken hang on let me turn down the volume a little bit i have played definitely not fried chicken and it went well it went very well I really enjoyed Definitely Not Fried Chicken when we last played. Um, in the VOD, if you're watching this in the VOD, I'll leave a uh, a pinned comment down below. Uh, going to the last time we played this, our playlist of Definitely Not Fried Chicken, we played in Early Access before. But now it's 1.0 and I would like to play, like, I don't know what they have to offer for full, full release, right? So I'm very excited about that. There's a lot of things. Story progression has uh, now finished out. I believe the story is now flushed out completely uh, compared to the last time we played. Um, there's new different types of products that you can get in the 1.0 release as well. And I'm sure a lot of other things that we have not ever touched before here in Definitely Not Fried Chicken. We will be doing a new save. And when we played last time, our playlist went up to basically the end of the story as where it was. And um, we kind of did everything we could in early access. Uh, this game, I think, came out about, I want to say early access it was like maybe at the beginning of the year this year so it hasn't been in uh early access for a long time yeah so i'm ready for it i'm definitely excited for it. i know a lot of people that have been around the channel like i said they really like this game and we're back at it so welcome in everybody to definitely not fried chicken the not so legal uh fast food business or la laundromat business or any business so to speak how are you and welcome and thank you mary cooper for the re-up and shabby do thank you for the re-up and lizzie thank you for becoming a member as well welcome in y'all and stays face how are you doing spork how are you spork Susie t barclay elliot how are you welcome in welcome in lady fluffy freaking dragon hello hello who that dude how's it going susu bun says first time being here early and hi how you doing susu bun hope you are doing well as well yes 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 good to see you john how are you welcome in hello malachi welcome hello stephen crawford robo power hello hello alexander good to see you good to see you welcome in welcome in uh roxanne hello roxanne yes honey how are you honey where how are you good to see you hello yes 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 let's see how are you let's see in pandemonium how are you joined back in because i've never seen this game and the title was intriguing this game is pretty cool if you like tycoon management games if you kind of like a tycoon management game plus combat it kind of almost feels like a rim world type game ish in a way there's some aspects in that if you kind of like that kind of thing uh you'll you might like this game for sure hello jupiter how are you jupiter good to see you welcome in dennis hello dennis time alive welcome in as well waffle hello waffle yes 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 howdy howdy shay how you doing shay shay carbonated crouton hello hello and everybody lurking smirking and possibly working on this wednesday how are you new game absolutely uh cans that is what we will name it we'll do the, actually uh can stream um because i think it's just the you know the, the same file tutorial we will leave the tutorial on in case people have never seen this game and honestly i'm gonna need some uh refresher back since i haven't played it in a while we'll do the tutorial warning flashing lights appear in this game so warning to everybody that's watching this at home or at work flashing lights indeed hello miss pandy purple how are you let's start it and let's get into some more definitely not fried chicken hello lexi how are you good to see you yes you're gonna watch the stream while it's storming outside watch out i wish i could have a nice storm come through and just knock me out well maybe i don't wish that but i wish it would just rain sideways for just, just one time just let it rain sideways please hello maya how you doing maya j welcome in as well I don't know where a good place to put my face, but I guess right now this is fine. Yeah, so already the UI seems updated. So they've updated the UI, which looks a lot cleaner. Indeed. There used to be this like bad loading, like memory leak bug back in the day. But I don't think we have to worry about that anymore. Welcome to a sunny paradise city. Oh, very well. With clean streets. Thank you. A booming economy. A healthy export market. That's new. New buildings are going up every day. A shopper's delight. A city blue collar workers call home. A white collar workers alike. All on the foundation of good local government, sarcastically. It kind of gives like a 1980s like Miami vibe, right? You have moved across country and accepted a job as a chicken shop manager to be part of this prosperous community. Chicken and waffles. 
yes oh wow the ui has definitely updated this is the major howdy partner you must be my new manager my friends call me the major but you can call me boss <laughs> we have 424 20 money if you can get this place back up and running i'll pay you a nice juicy bonus how does fifty thousand dollars sound pan around and all that good stuff we will hold down the button and drag it yes 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 there you go hit my was i am very good at that to rotate the camera we will do that and that and this and that and all that good stuff yeah 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 yeah. game is running very smoothly too i love little chickens they're so cute and tasty place a chicken coop in the chicken restaurant yeah so this is going to get a little bit crazy in case like i said you haven't seen this before i think i might actually move my forehead off over here i think that might be a better way so that we can see what's going on here uh but like i said the ui i am so glad they updated the ui it looks so much better so yes in order to run a chicken shop we must put down chicken you can see where this is going <laughs> the colored square underneath the coop indicates whether it is a viable location there we go we have done that and we will hit the escape or right click to simply stop placing objects time to turn these little chicks into little nugs put a small blender in the kitchen to to complete the process tree don't tell animal wel welfare about this one right yeah so uh, to make chicken nuggets because everybody in the farming games want me to name every chicken a nugget well now you actually get your wish well done on setting up the chicken nuggets production line as you've learned the first for the whole pro production line to work you must have at least one appliance from each part of the process tree now we need some new employees I worked my last ones to the bone. Ha 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 ha. We'll start with a regular worker, of course. All right, employees, workers, hire. There we go. For them to work making some nuggies and fries. Very well. And fries and nuggets. We'll need another worker to serve our customers, too. Very well. We will do that. Let's cl collapse that. Bring this down. Register. All right, so looking at these broken signs out front, it make, makes us look like we're a joke. Let's hire an engineer to fix up your equipment. Let's do it, shall we? we also need a cleaner to clean up the place. Otherwise, our food can become contaminated. Yeah, very well. Contaminated. Yeah, I don't think that's one thing that we're worried about here. We can give our employees a custom work schedule. Let's make a new one for our customers. Very well. We shall do that. New. Click the icons to change what the employees will do from each hour. I had like an entire system last time I played too. It was kind of great. Uh, we'll leave that to work there uh, let's assign a new schedule to one of our employees okay schedule name so we have schedule uh, this could be like I don't know this could be like work day and this could be break day or something I don't know so we have zero to zero wait a sec I just realized they did they did 24 hour format with a.m. and p.m. <laughs> okay right uh break my br brain a little bit right we have two two of both worlds happening right now Anyways, people, you will be on Caroline White will be scheduled to schedule. There we go. We're not worrying about this too much. This is the tutorial. This won't be our actual place of business uh, today, later on. While our, while our new employees will love working their jobs for the rest of their lives, they do have other annoying needs. Employees will need a bathroom to maintain their hygiene along with a break room to take a break from their wonderful jobs. See the dirt patch out back? Uh, I guess so, yeah. Um, let's build a toilet for our new employees there. I tried making my pr previous employees hold it in, and let me tell you, it wasn't pretty. Ha ha ha. But in building mode, you simply click. Very well, we will do that. Staff toilets. We need to make a staff toilet back here. Let's rotate the camera. Let's build this out, and we'll build it right there. Perfect. We're also going to need, like, put a door and things like that, right? I'm assuming. There you go. There's your door. Once you're happy, the toilet is large enough. Toggle the building mode off. Uh, we should probably put actual toilets in there, though. There we go. Maybe a sink or something. I'll put two stalls. There we go. Oh, wait. How do you rotate that? Okay, that's how you rotate that. Very good. And then I guess a shower you could technically do, but uh, we're fine. It wouldn't be much of a wash closet. Is that what they call it in overseas? Wash closet? Wash rooms or something? Without a toilet? Please? Yeah, we've already done the toilet, my good man. You, you're, I'm way ahead of you. I'm way ahead of the game, baby. And a door to access it. Remember to select the correct... Oh, my gosh. We're way ahead of you. Oh, God. You hear that noise? Yeah, 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 yeah. The chickens, the chickens are going through the blender right now. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, man. Okay, we're going to need a sink. Put in the sink. 
put in a dryer as well. Yeah, I totally screwed this one up, didn't I? There we go. Dryer. Perfect. There's your staff bathroom. Our employees need a place to hang out and take a break. Let's give them a staff break room now. Uh, right. Staff break room build. And we'll build that right there. Ooh, yoink. Perfect. Hit me with a door. Also perfect. Come back over here. Put a couch and a TV. All that good stuff. There we go. TV right there. Anything else? I don't think anything else, right? No, I think we're pretty much good. Uh, let's see. Build a staff break room and then place a door. Oh, we need a coffee. Shoot, a coffee vending machine. There we go. And then we can open up business. So we now are opened up and things like that. Uh, I'm going pretty fast because, like I said, this isn't going to be our place of business. Great work, partner. You fixed my chicken shop right up. In fact, you did such a great job. I think this place could run itself. In other words, you're fired. Ha <laughs> ha What? Yeah, we got fired by the major. Go figure. Hello, Lars. Hello, Ruth. Welcome in. Yes, yes, yes. All right, so your attorney says, Hello, my name is Mr. Attorney. I represent a group of individuals who have an interest in seeing an increase in the supply and the sale of recreational materials in this area. Hence, quote unquote, recreational materials. We've heard you were looking for new opportunities. Are you interested? I am interested. You can trade your products with our local businesses for various upgrades. The university can supply new equipment. The gun shop will trade for new weapons and traps and things like that. And the scrapyard can provide new vehicles and other useful items. Great. The city has opened up the this derelict park uh, as a new enterprise zone. We have taken the liberty of providing you with two plots of land free of charge to, for you to get started. The plots were provided you free of charge are this corner plot. What the heck did that just say? What? Oh, this? Oh. Thank you. Factory? Subplots? Purchase? Purchase. Those are our two plots right now. Very well. All right. So you can buy more plots here to expand your build buildable, buildable area. With each new plot you buy, you will also be able to hire two additional employees for your chicken factory. Quote unquote. While we're here, let's just place a vertical road to connect to the main road. You'll need uh, to connect your garages for later. Yeah. So basically this first area that we have here, um, this is where like the main stuff is going to happen. Like this is where we get our products out and stuff like that. So you'll see. So now you've got some land and I'll help you get started with a small or small. Wait, I'll help you get set up with a small farm producing basic cannabis. Yeah. So our first product is going is going to be cannabis. First, build a grow room and add a door. Then following the process tree, place four basic cannabis beds, one cannabis drying pallet, and one cannabis cutting bench. Very well. Um, so let's see here. Grow room. Okay, build. Wait, we have the storeroom, grow room, and garage. I'm, I just want to make sure I do this like in a... Because you, you really want to think about how you build your layout. Because um, people can attack your factory and all that good stuff. So I guess we'll just follow the guide here and let them take us. And then we will adjust to it later. So there's our grow room, you could say. We will add the growing plot. There you go. We will add the drying rack. There we go. Oh, do we need another one of these? We do. There we are. There we are. There we are. Okay, so we have four grows. And we need to get a cutting, uh, cutting table. There we go. Awesome. So you can improve the quality of your products by adjusting the em environmental conditions in which they are produced. Which, uh, what that means is basically, uh, right now, if we were to have our cannabis grow, we would only get one star quality cannabis. So what you need to do is you got to make sure the conditions for that plant are, are, are good. So the ideal, I guess, condition for this plant would be they want to have 50 to 100 lights on it. So yeah, that is what we want to do to increase the quality of the cannabis which I think it might show us. For an example, if you add lights near the basic cannabis plot, this will improve the quality of the cannabis to good or even excellent. Uh, each appliance that processes a product has a useful tip, which tells you the ideal conditions, which I just basically kind of already checked out and saw, which is that. As you can see, the lighting level is less than ideal, so let's do something about that. So let's go and grab some light, area of effects lights. And the only ones that we have right now, we don't have any ones that hang from the ceiling because those are things that we have to research later. But right now, we have to just live with uh standing lights 
So these give off 60 uh, lights altogether, and it has a little bit of an area effect that does go down depending on tile. But those two lights will then actually, well, yeah, as you can see, gives us three quality uh, cannabis, uh, quality cannabis production, I guess is the right word. I don't know. But yes, that's three stars there now across the board. So we would be producing the best cannabis in town, so to speak. You're able to modify the area effect amounts to fine tune your factory design. We do not need all these lights to fully be lit and it will be more economical to turn down some of them. So yeah, what that means, if you know the thing is like at 100 max and we don't actually need 100 max, we can hover around 50 to 100. We can tone down the lighting to save money on our electricity bill because the electricity bill will be uh, something we have to worry about later. Look on the lights to open their configuration panel, then turn their lighting values down to level 50. So, okay, let's look that move. That what we have to do, move? What the heck, move? Okay, right. Uh, we'll turn tone it down to 50. So right now it'd be $14 per day for that one light. If we tone it down to 50, it'll be $12 a day per light. There we go. And that area of effect still is uh, looking pretty good, yeah? No. Oh. There we go, okay. Head move toggle, my bad. There we go. So we save a little bit of money and we still have our cannabis running at three stars. So the overlay option will show you the current environmental values for each grid location. Very useful for uh, fine tuning conditions. This is the overlay and this shows us. Okay. Yeah, this gives off so much light. Uh, they really changed the this little grid thing since the last time I played. Uh, it looks again a lot cleaner even now. So that's really good. So congratulations. Your farm is now producing excellent quality basic cannabis, better quality drugs, fetch, fetch higher prices, of course. We also need to hire some workers to turn the, these basic cannabis seeds into pure profit. Let's hire two workers. All right, workers. We will hire two people. This will be Joshua and Addison coming to work for us. So using the task toggles on this task panel, let's get these guys working on the basic cannabis product line and a vehicle loading, which we will be doing eventually. So cannabis and vehicle loading. There we go. And then you also do cannabis and vehicle loading which we will do and fine tune this a little bit more when we get more people to work for us. Sometimes you will acquire unique items that your employees can use to gain a bonus. Let's equip one now. So in this case, everybody has inventories. At least your workers have inventories and we have garden gloves um, that you can actually buy from different stores and things like that. You can buy equipment, clothing items, weapons, and things like that for your uh, workers if you need to. So they're giving us gardening gloves and what gardening gloves do is at least for this one person, because we only have one, it actually makes a minus 50% cooldown time on cannabis uh, plants. So we'll go ahead and do that. Add that. And I honestly think I should. Oh my God. <laughs> I have so much stuff. Okay, hopefully, I don't know. I don't know if we're going to be keeping that body armor and that stuff. I don't know if they'll give it to us or not. So great. You have a small basic cannabis farm. Now you have successfully created your product. Uh, you need to set up a storeroom to get the box and ready for ship. Build a store room, then add two boxing stations. These will be used to package your product ready for shipping. So there we go. We'll build our store room out. Um, I'm honestly just going to follow along, even though I don't really care for and like this, like that, like this layout that they're doing for us here. But like I said, we'll just play along. I would like to have a door right here, too. Uh, we will then add the package table. There we go. Two of them. Perfect. Let's place two storage shelves. All right. Not enough personally, but again, tutorial sake. There we go. Well done. Your product can now be boxed and it is ready for distribution. You will need to hire an armed guard to protect your product. Hire a guard from the employees, right? All right. So now we need a guard. There we go. We got a guard. Uh, selecting on the guard, we can give him a baseball bat, of course. So inventory and then give you a baseball bat, a deadly bat now with added nails. There we go. One of our guards has a baseball bat. So your production now has at least a little protection. Your guard will now freely roam around your compound, or if you want, you can learn to give them a room group using the criminal education program later on. Uh, now you've made and packaged your product. You'll need a delivery vehicle to share it with the world. All right, now we need to go ahead and build ourselves a garage. And the one thing that we can only do right now is mopeds. Uh, you can have mopeds, cars, trucks, and big trucks. So that's kind of cool. Uh, when we played last, we were only able to get mopeds and cars, pick up trucks, and actually the big trucks, the, 
ox trucks were not available at the time when we played last time so yeah great you're almost ready to start shipping out your product to loyal customers now we just need to buy a hotline purchasing the hotline monument will allow you to start accepting customers or orders from around the city these customers will pay cold hard cash navigate to the hotline so pretty ricky let's get pretty ricky on the hotline please perfect so to start getting calls from interested customers turn on your hotline so now we will turn on our hotline this is our map entirely our hotline is now turned on and we can start offering people basic cannabis now later on when you get more products you can say i have toasted to sell i have amazonian to sell i've cloudy clear moon crack pure and flaming for sale but we only have one right now that we're producing so let's turn it on and the menu below contains all the drug types i have only ticked the basic cannabis drug for now other monuments will provide you with other benefits especially if you upgrade them these hotline customers will pay you for as many boxes as you can deliver within the time limit very well that's our wait that's our fact garage name factory very well yeah that's us so you're now a bona fide genuine drug exporter <laughs> Your whole operation is now up and running. I'll leave it to you if you need an extra help. See the criminal education program later. Don't forget your employees will literally die for you if you don't look after them. So keep an eye on that major fella. He might not be happy with you stealing his business. This is where the criminal education program, which program is, I guess, spelled differently. And is this like a different way to spell program? I guess it is, right? Is located by the way. All right. So cr criminal education program setting up a business creating a room configuring a uh, products accepted at an appliance unlock toasted cannabis and place a trap so it's kind of like um going down a quest list in a way um kind of like things to do right now and look forward to and kind of like start going so setting up a business purchase a laundromat business license um and then we will get a torch which is a flashlight <laughs> which would give our people weapon accuracy if we gave them a torch um or we can create a room group, which is pretty easy. If we do that, we can get uh, headphones uh, for our people. Uh, configuring products accepted at an appliance. Um, dryer to only accept. Okay, yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll do that later. And then that we'll do later. So I guess the first thing we need to do is buy our first legal bet business so that we can turn it into or so we can turn it into a front. If you've never known what a front is, this is basically the start of a front. Now, we are free to move about the cabin, so to speak. Uh, we are free to kind of do whatever we want with this. Uh, what I want to do, actually right off the bat here, I want to put a door like right there so that they don't have to go outside just to access that. Now, our bodyguard can... Can... Um... Protect kind of protect us with this baseball bat maybe i don't know i don't really feel very confident about it i would like to also i think i would like to buy an extra plot can i do that can i buy this extra plot go to subplots yeah so i would like to buy an extra plot because we're going to need some more room it's eleven thousand dollars we have 30k already in the bank so this is kind of a big deal early on so i'm going to do that and buy that right away and we'll expand so we're gonna need to build areas like a kitchen a staff break room a toilet a bedroom for these people so that they can live their their lives hopefully happily because if you overwork someone i think they will die if you overwork them and we don't want to do that now do we i will then set up a schedule for these people and i will hire more people and things like that as we progress but for right now we're kind of just doing the bare minimum and trying to get us off the ground now if i go to businesses i can see all the different businesses this is our factory uh there's a lot of businesses that are around a lot of plots that are open that are just for sale uh this is the bishop's boulevard and this is a pretty big plot it's seven thousand dollars and the things that you could do here is have a chicken shop and a donut shop so there's a lot of different licensed buildings that you can have in this game you can have a lobster rebs, a restaurant, a seafood restaurant. You can have a club, a nightclub, I believe. Um, you can have a casino, I think you can have in this game. But what we want is we want a laundromat. Um, that's a laundromat right there. But I have a particular 
a laundry mat I have in mind. Let's see if I can find it. First and foremost, Oak Lane. Oak Lane. $3,000. It's one of the cheapest plots. And, um, oh, by the way, we got extra money, I think, maybe, from completing a quest. I don't know. But maybe not. No, maybe I'm just miscalculating. We want to purchase this, and we want to put a laundromat inside this little tiny, like, plot here. So let's go in and purchase that. This is now our plot. So if we go to business license, we can go ahead and buy a laundromat license, which means, guess what? We have a laundromat. So we have laundromat, donut shop, which is 6K, chicken shop, which is 9K, lobster restaurant at the Red Lobster, which is 12K, nightclub, which is at 15K, casino, which is at 18K. And different restaurants, different places of business take different kinds of narcotics and things like that. Uh, since we're doing the basics, we're doing the cannabis, just give me a nice easy laundromat. Uh, give me the license for 3k as well. So you have to buy the plot and buy the license, but it's only a one-time license. I think you have to buy. But now it's legit. We have the license. Um, we can now start to uh, go this route and start setting it up and all that, which yeah, why not? Set it up. <laughs> um, yeah, I just, I mean, we're going to have to anyways, 13k. 13k yeah um hmm i want to try to do it the cheapest route monuments okay i just want to take a look at our monuments and see how much they cost to construction sites legislation office and pawn shop with a gym the gym okay very well hmm how do I want to do this? How do I want to do this? Let's see. Let's see. Let's go back to here. I kind of want to make a dinky little little laundromat. Now, the thing about it is that you want to make sure that you are building something that kind of goes in line with parking, because what's going to happen is we're going to have our place, our factory, which is where our cannabis is, the garages, which will then have the mopeds and the mopeds will drive the product to the laundromat. And we want to have the fastest way of them getting out of the moped delivering the cannabis to the laundromat and all that. So we want it to be kind of seamless in a way. Yeah. Hey, KK, how's it going? Welcome in. Welcome in. Yeah, yep, yep. Hey, Lilith Rose, how are you? Welcome in. AMG, hi, how are you? Good to see you as well. So let's go ahead and build this dinky little laundromat, so to speak. Uh, we want to put up walls first and foremost. So this is going to be laundromat. So we actually make money for doing the illegal side of the laundromat and we make legal money clean money by doing the legal side of the laundromat so there's like kind of like two different incomes working here now i'm gonna go one path away from the sidewalk and i think i'm gonna this doesn't look very dinky now does it <laughs> we'll drop 3k right there i'll have this is where i'm assuming uh the moped shows up i'm gonna have like a back office actually you know what that's what i need to do let's make this can we do this a storeroom storeroom there this will be the front of the laundromat and then maybe we go maybe at like a staff toilet right there and then we go like a staff break room right here something like that i kind of like it uh customer toilet also needs to exist as well place that right there and then let's get some doors in here uh, this will be kind of like the back entrance where the cannabis will come in We'll throw it in right there. And this will be the front entrance to our laundromat. We'll just slide that bad boy right there. Make sure we put a door for them there. And then we'll make like a counter. And then we'll do that. Okay, so I have it built in my head. I know you might be thinking, what is this guy doing? Don't worry, I have it built in my head. You'll see, you'll see eventually. Laundromat is going to need a counter where people come and purchase their cannabis, but also maybe even purchase some soap, possibly. I don't know. Uh, so let's go counter and how do I want to do this? Let's zoom in. We want to go. Um, I want to make sure that they, I can make two registers here. That's what I want. Let's go like that. And then like, oh gosh. Oh, take that away. Actually, you know what? Put that right there. Let's put a corner. Put a corner. That's what I'll do. And then I'll put the soap detergent right there. And then I'll put a register. Hopefully this works. This won't work exactly how I want. A register there and maybe I'll back this up a little bit more. There we go. 
perfect and then right there and that should at least slide us another register right here too all right so as long as we have two registers i know it's like a lot of wasted counter space there but it's a little weird when it comes to like doors and and, and soap and whatnot now a lot of washers and dryers you can get upgraded washers and dryers later later on we only have the weak stuff we only have a washing machine i don't even think we have a dryer yeah we don't even have a dryer so all we have to offer is just a washing machine <laughs> just kind of a uh, depressing as is but yeah that's all we got for you and then we have like a couple of benches for people to like wait on i guess let's actually rotate that okay that's what we got that's what we'll do so to get other things like a gumball machine to get a dryer and things like that we're gonna need to upgrade our business license and upgrade our business license i gotta figure out where to do that I, oh actually i think that's um business yes capacity right top business license marketing we need to get these stars up is what we need to do i kind of forgot how to get the business license upgraded there might be through something yeah something uh, take me back here though and let's finish this out how much money do we have eight thousand oh my gosh i'm already crying inside uh storeroom let's go ahead and um no 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 storeroom shelving please we'll put those three there for now and if we need to add more we'll add more later and then uh customer toilet oh yeah we got to do the customer toilet as well mm -hmm. i have a green washer available do i have a green washer available let me see Oh yeah, I do. I do have a dryer. You're right. Okay, good, good, good. We do have a dryer. Good eye, good eye. See, that's why you're in chat and I'm over here blindly playing this game. Um, not knowing what the heck I'm doing. No. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, so that's good. So we do have a dryer. All right, cool. So we have washer and dryer. That makes up for it. Uh, let's go here. Customer toilet. There we go. Perfect. We'll add two toilets. I think. And a hand dryer. That should be fine enough. And then over here, we'll do a staff toilet. Uh, maybe just one will be okay. Wait, wrong one. No, we'll do two. We'll do two. And then we'll go sink. Dryer. Do I need to have a shower? I feel like I don't need this, but... You know what? It's better be safe than sorry. I don't know. Uh, Couch. Yep, we'll do a couch. Have a TV in there. Give them a little bit of vending machine action because you know break rooms having a vending machine is a very big deal we all know that right a big big deal everybody loves vending machines it's a magical colorful thing all right so there we go now that is pretty much the business that we have we're gonna have to hire people to run it obviously but i would like to do some maybe some light pad actually maybe some grass out here i think grass is i think it's actually i don't think you have to pay for it I don't think yeah i think it's free i think it's free to like put grass and stuff out do like a little bit of that action what do you think yeah make it look a little bit prettier you know what we'll make the whole lot grass that's what we'll do go perfect and then we'll probably we'll, we're going to expand this laundromat eventually when we get more money and more traffic but right now it's fine we'll do light pa pathing or dark i like the dark do dark pathing as far as decorations look they don't get a tree right now or do they okay, maybe they get flowers okay fine they get flowers it costs money but they get it fine <laughs> fine 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 that's fine okay so before i start hiring um employees here i kind of want to get a Let's see here. Top license purchase cleaner. Okay, yeah, we're going to need cleaner during business hours. Our business hours are 6 to 1900. So really, all I need to do is have a cleaner working through business hours, which should be fine. We're going to go workers. I would like to have two workers. So there's a like, I'm going to try to play the game like I did last time and see if it still works. I would like someone to have store storage um so we'll do someone that's just storing no we'll have someone do both for now i can't imagine it's gonna be i don't know i can't imagine it's gonna be very long or like it's gonna be hectic at first so you know what we'll just do that for now uh schedule wise this is 600 to 1900 the, the the laundromat is open so let's name this 
work one. And so 600, we want them to work six, whoops, six to 19, was it 1900? Yeah, break. Uh, we don't want you to do anything from here to here to here. Okay, this is, yeah, I want that. That's fine. Break. So one, two, three, four, five. We'll give you a break at 11 and 12. No, you know what? I think we'll, we'll let you go. You'll be done for the day. And then we'll have someone come in for one, two, three, four, five hours in the, in the next, uh, next, um, in the morning shift. So let's go work. Oh my Lord. What just happened? Take me back to that. No. Okay. Work. Okay, never mind. Can't do that. Don't capitalize. We'll do. Okay, you can't press M. That's a big issue. <laughs> I can't type the letter M in here. So let's go AM. Can I? Oh, wait. AM shift. Let's go. How do I, early shift, I guess, since I can't use M. Early shift. All right, early shift. And then we'll do uh, late shift. As long as I'm avoiding the M key. We'll do late shift and then late shift will be kind of very similar, just not like that. So go, there we go. There we go. So the late shift will have someone come in at 12 a.m. And work until 1600. And this, these are the people that do the register and coming and bringing storage stuff in. There will be a night shift. We'll have early shift, late shift and a night shift. And then we'll have a cleaner shift all together as well. Hello, Adam. How are you? Good to see you, Adam. Yes, yes, yes. <clears throat> hey, Anthony, how are you? Good to see you. What's going on? What's going on? Mm -mm 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 -mm. Um, let's go uh, night shift. Night shift. And the night shift people are people that are going to basically all the night shift does is just bring drugs in. That's all they do. They bring the product in at night. It's kind of a it's, I don't want to say it's a waste of money, but you know, it. it it's not a productive time. Let's just say that. So the night shift will come in. I don't know, maybe like 1800, 2000. We'll do 1800 or sorry, 2000. I don't know. Do I, do I have a night shift? Maybe I I'll make that for now, but I don't know about that. Okay. So as far as a cleaner, this will be the cleaner schedule. And the cleaner schedule will work at 600 with a break. So four, five. All right, we'll give them a one hour break and then hit me with another five, two, three, four, five. And then you will go home after that. So hopefully that's all business hours. I mean, we're missing technically one business hour there. I don't know if that actually counts. We'll have a cleaner. We might have two cleaner shifts. We might just do early shift, night, uh, late shift and have two cleaners. That's what we might do. Okay, so uh, you need to go on early shift, Logan uh, Sanchez. And then we will hire someone to do the night shift. You will do the night shift. Come on. Late shift. Not night shift, late shift. And then we will hire a cleaner. And the cleaner, we'll see if this works here. I don't know if it's going to work or not. Change you to blue, light blue. And the cleaner will do the cleaner shift. We're going to need an engineer. Engineer will probably have their own shift as well. Yeah. Hey, Tanya, how's it going? It closes at 1900. Wait, did I, not, did I do the schedule wrong? Oh, I did do the schedule wrong, huh? 1600. You're right. It does close at 1900. Okay, well, in that case, we're going to switch it up to, then. We're going to have the night shift in there as well. A uh, night shift will come in at 19. We'll do one, two, three, four, and five. Okay, we're going to hire three more people then. One, two, three, four, five. All right, that's what we'll do. So we'll have three shifts. Early shift, late shift, and night shift. Very well. Um, in that case, let's do two cleaner shifts. A cleaner early early um yeah so we'll do 
early shift and then we'll do cleaner uh late shift so one two three four okay this is tough um let's see so if i do early shift can i work you one two three four five six what if i worked you six i made you come in at five early to rest like you come in at five you rest up no that's pointless i give you a break at 12. you work for an additional two more hours and then we have a little bit of overlap here one two three four five something like that we could do but we'll have to test it we'll have to trial error it that's what we're gonna have to do we're gonna have to test it out and see how they react to it the reason why i'm sticking to a five hour format is just in case you know i don't know what their limitation is it's basically where i'm at here so we'll do this uh cleaner late shift okay we'll do something like that now technically actually you know what this is what we'll do no that doesn't work now does it actually that does work Okay, technically every hour will now have a cleaner on it. Yeah, that works. Paying a bit, and you can really get lost in this game when you pay people too much. And that's what we don't want to do. We don't want to pay people too much. So cleaners are now, one has a early cleaner. Let's hire another cleaner. And then this next cleaner, Leonardo Diaz, will be the late cleaner. Cleaner late. And they will also be that color as well. Okay, so we should be good to go. We should be good to go. Cleaner early, cleaner late. We have a two star now, so now all business hours are ready to go. And as far as engineer goes, we got to work on that schedule now. And this one's not too hard to do. How are you doing, Tanya? What's going on? Good to see you, Tanya. <laughs> Thank you for the super chat, Tanya. Hopefully we are doing a long stream tonight. I'm so excited. Good to see you. I know you really like this game, right? Good to see you. Welcome in um so i would like to do a different shift let me click on this um uh schedule so let's do engineer shift yeah engineer is going to be a little bit different engineer did i spell that right so the engineer is going to come in before the shop opens obviously to work on stuff if there's stuff that needs to be worked on they can work on it do nothing do nothing do nothing uh, they will be here also like there. This is going to be a weird, this is going to be a terrible shift for them. And then hopefully the dryers and washing machines don't break throughout the day. We'll do something like this. Maybe. Make sure they're open and ready to go by the morning. Do nothing for the rest of the day. Come in and do that. I'm thinking kind of like a split shift kind of thing. This is definitely going to be worked on, I think. Th that will be worked on. I don't, I'm not very confident in that, to be honest with you. Uh, you go on engineer. All right. So the laundromat has the people. We're good. They're good. You should be fine. I can, you know, put them to the specific rooms if I want to, but it's pretty big or it's pretty small here, so I don't feel like I need to. Um, we have two workers, one working early shift, one working late shift. We have one engineer and we have two, uh, cleaners as well. So I think that should be fine. Let's head back over to the factory. Cause we're going to need to do some stuff here. $2,500 is all we have. Not a lot. I'm going to be real with you. Not a lot. Yeah. So we have, what do we have? Three people here. We have three people here. No, we have two people. No, we have three. We have two workers, one guard here. Um, and we can use that early shift for them, I guess. We could do that, right? Okay, we want people working this 24 hours. This is a 24 hour job. 
Yeah, this is a 24 hour job. Well, somebody's not going to work 24 hours, though. Um, Let's do factory schedule, maybe. Factory. Factory work. Factory early. We'll do factory early. Um, we'll work at midnight. We'll work at midnight. Five hours straight. One break. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Break there. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. And then do nothing for the rest of the that. And then we'll do a late shift for factory. So there'll be, you know, this is the, this is the uh, aches and pains, right? Of the early game. We'll go factory late. And we'll do everything here in the evening. And we'll just kind of copy it in a way. 400. There we go. Perfect. All right. So we're just about ready to start this bad boy up. Yeah. All right. Now we'll go to our people and put you on. I wish you could like open up a tab and select something here on this schedule. Factory early. We'll put you on factory early and we'll put you on factory late. All right. So two people at least working throughout the day, throughout the night, things like that. Um, <laughs> Drivers, we're gonna need a driver, so we're gonna need to hire a driver. So let's hire a driver, right? I'm pretty sure. Is that how that works? No, no, I'm an idiot. Drivers don't exist, right? I don't think drivers exist in this game. Okay, so then what I'm gonna do is instead, I'm not gonna fire him since I've already spent the 500 for him. What I'm gonna, gonna do is I'm gonna make another schedule, and this will be factory. Oh my god, I hate that I can't press M. Uh, I need to use the letter M. <laughs> Factory noon-ish. We'll do call it noon-ish. Okay. We'll have this person work five. One, two, three, four, five. And then break, break. And then one, two, break. Actually, you'll do a long break. You'll do a four-hour break. So the amount of hours people work they get paid for those hours that they work too. So you also got to think about that. So we'll do something like that, I think. Now, I don't know if hours also counts for their breaks. I'm not sure. Like if you pay them for their hour breaks or if you pay them for their hour, hour works. I'm not really entire, entirely sure. Yeah. <clears throat> hey, Andy. How you doing, Andy? What's going on? Good to see you. Hope you're doing well. Hey, Colbs. Good to see you, Colbs. I think they you need to fix 17 and 18 hours. Wait, what? Fix 17 and 18 hours? Uh, 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 uh. Have a good one, Lady Fluffy Dragon. Do take care. Hey, Floatery B, how are you? So yeah, we'll do this. We'll do Factory Noonish. And that takes care of like morning and late afternoon ish, but not like in the middle of the night or late at night. So that's what we'll do. We'll put this person on factory noon ish. There we go. Yeah, well. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, as far as this, like when mopeds do start coming here, we can kind of control whether or not mopeds like go out. And when they go out, they can go out in a continuous basis or we can manually do them. So I'm not sure what we're going to do there quite yet. Uh, we are at a two star. What do we need? So we need all products available, which we can't do yet. And top license purchase. We can't do that quite yet either. That's fine. So. Yeah, I don't know what this I don't know what purchase a business plot. I think we already did that. And then setting up a business. I think we've already done that, too. I'm not sure why those are uh unless i gotta set this do i have to set this as a no it's already set right yeah oak lane yeah this is already set so i'm not sure what's going on there let's see creating a room group we could do that just for the headphones it slows fun reduction i kind of want to do that so let's go over here and just create a room group real quick um factory no build people rooms room group oops We'll just do, we'll just make something temp. 
I would like to can I not delete that no I, all right there <laughs> I, what <laughs> what okay can I delete it no I can't delete rooms uh, uh oh not good uh, well did I at least finish that did I finish that okay assign the room group to an employee okay let's do that real quick let's go people and we'll just assign someone to that real quick there we go that worked okay so now we have the headphones in all right so we got the headphones in put that away and then let's do let me go back to that because I want to take them off of that no thank you all rooms there we go we'll do the groups later when I you know when, when we're ready to do that we're not ready to do that quite yet we have headphones um configure products accepted at an appliance i think that's what this is oops we'll just do this because we don't have amazonian or the burnt stuff yet there we go that should fix that right no at m at a mk1 cannabis dryer oh that's an upgraded uh, dryer i think and then unlock toasted assign a vehicle to delivery to the university and then lock toasted very well placing traps we don't have any traps yet okay let's go now to mopeds right moped is already ready so can i let me go to my map now i'll press freaking m so here's our map let's go to orders so our moped is there and then we can tell them to go elsewhere i guess we can tell them to go there take basic stuff there if we want to but i'm not going to do that quite yet actually i am i'm going to do that right away so hopefully that right there means that goes there yeah okay it's a little bit different from the last time i played and it kind of seems like it really 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 dumbed it down with this um okay so drugs to transport very well we'll just have one just so we can keep organized here there we go and we can change the color okay we can change the color i like that i like that you can change the color that's pretty good okay cool all right so i think we're ready to press play and i think we're ready to actually uh, get this thing going let's real quick before we do that let's get a little bit of landscaping in get some pavement because it's looking good god awful there we go perfect there we go and then we'll adjust as we go there we are perfect Okay. Ready? Oh, I'm scared. Holy Lord. All right. I know. I know. It takes a while to set up everything, but we've done it. We've set it all up and all we got to do now is just fine tune it. Yeah. Fine tune it. All right. Here we go. All right. So straight up though, um, I want to work with some of, or one of these people. Can I work on one of these people? I would like to give them at least a headphone slows fun reduction. So we'll, we'll give them that looks like we have a santa hat we have a lobster hat we have a chicken hat we have a chef hat we have a scientist hat drug production speed that's pretty good samurai helmet gives hp we should probably give that to our um our guy that has a baseball bat <laughs> oh all right you let's get you and throw on some scientist glasses i guess there you go because you're going to be working right you're going to be doing the um your production right I'm, i hope so you're doing production okay yeah you are the guy that needs a samurai helmet oh they purchase i forgot you had to purchase these these aren't cheap oh my god i forgot you purchased these and they're not free i'm an actual fool okay all right i totally forgot about that anyways continue ariana grande says i'm having a party tonight and i need some stuff do we help her out she needs basic drugs and she needs it in six minutes paid per box delivered i'm gonna be honest with you sweetheart i'm gonna have to reject this because i don't even have anything started yet so i'm gonna reject that we'll keep it going you're right i need a break room kitchen and all that i'm a effing coward okay ah oh, i don't have money for that you guys are gonna have to suffer okay okay so i would like to do some corridor action too eventually How do I want to do this? How do I want to do this? 
how do I want to do this? Corridor? $150, my lord. All right. Corridor. We'll do corridor. And then we'll kind of branch off a bit. And that's what we'll do. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll do that. I think I'm trying to think of the layout that I did last time. That was pretty efficient. I went out a bit more. I think honestly, they're going to have to work with no break right now. And we're just need to get something started and going. And then we, what we're going to need to do is get these products out and going and then open up the laundromat. I mean, technically we could open up the laundromat now. So let's make sure we do that. I guess we can make legal money, right? Does that count as a uh, setting up a business. It still doesn't count. I don't know what the deal is here then. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba, right. Okay. So 20 hundred laundromat's not even open. Uh, so we'll, we're, we're working in the nighttime right now. That's fine. We'll see here. Oh my God. There's a fly flying around me and he's this close from losing his actual life. <laughs> very, very close. All right. So we'll let this go. We'll kind of fast forward this. We're going to be spending a lot of money right now. Electricity worker pays union dues all these different things yeah no one's working 1700 to 1800 in the laundromat that's fine no that's fine I, I i think i know that yeah i think i know that yeah 1900 let's see here because i don't want to i don't want to hire too many people let's see you know late yeah, we have the yeah we have hang on a sec we have the early shift and we have the um late shift hang on a sec um let's see here hang on hang on hang on early shift i should have actually named that oh wait that's a different shift no cleaner early cleaner late okay i actually need to put them on the cleaner ones i think i'm on the wrong one see i'm already getting confused with the with the shift names if i could only just use the m key okay so cleaner early and then cleaner late that's what we'll do and that that should be fine everybody should be okay right yeah everybody's fine cleaner late cleaner early yeah we're good we're good we're good we're good we're good if i could just use the m key my lord you think the setting up a business is bugged setting up a business is bugged i can't use the m key that's bugged 1.0 is here Okay, so we have a couple of things drying out already. And then when those are dried out, we'll have these cut up, I think. We gotta go fast. We gotta get these things out and uh, out quickly. Okay, now they're being dried out. And the mopeds, once they're all loaded up, They'll head out. They'll send it to the laundromat. And I think I have... I don't know if I have someone in the night shift. At, like, the late, late, late night shift. We'll go ahead and see. Um, so we got that rolling. Let's see if I have someone at the late, late, late night shift. No, I don't have anybody here. So the moped's going to sit here and wait for somebody to show up. That's fine. I I'm all right with that. They will come eventually in the morning. The moped will wait. And then what, at the, what will happen here is we'll just kind of stock up on our storage here. So yeah, this is the early goes. I'm all right with this. This is fine. If anything, I need to buy more storage. We'll do that. We'll do that and we'll wait. Here we go. All about making money. We're going to be making money here very, very soon. Yes. I'm having a party tonight and I need some stuff. Well, now the moped is out there doing. See, now we've, we've, we've tied up the moped, right? How much is another moped? $250, $70 per day. All right, that's pretty cheap. I, I thought that was going to be a lot more expensive. We'll get another moped out there. I will accept this for a six minute paid per box delivery, I guess. I don't know what that means, paid per box delivery. It used to be something different. It used to be um, like they would ask for X amount, but I guess paid 
bot per box delivered i you know i guess that means however many you get there we will accept that though uh deliveries in this game are very 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 important uh so let's see here garage name garage name uh, i need to name these too let me name these real quick i name this moped garage how do you name these i'm sure you can right yes i can't use the m key i was trying to put moped <laughs> oh my god oh you freaking frack right now okay so again don't use the m key we'll call this noped noped one and this will be noped two and this will do one at a time so noped two and what we can do is we can actually separate these two we can make one deliver laundromat only and the other be delivery outside of the laundromat like to people's houses and things like that so i'll change the color so i don't get confused we'll change it to yellow yellow will be deliveries out green will be go to you know go to the to the laundromat type thing or i can make blue for laundromat noped one what the hell is happening wait what <laughs> why are these switching up and down okay noped one that noped two that okay okay noped one look here brother noped two sorry i need you to go oh god where do i need you to go i need you to go to is this where the customer is at i can't tell no that's not where the customer is at this is where the customer is at no is that where the customer is at yes that's where the customer is at hotline okay go to the hotline holy hell all right we did it moped is out or no pet is out going good i know not being able to use the m key when you type is insane i agree i agree my lord how have they not fixed this all right so here we go the major is here we've generated 100 dollars, our first hundred dollars so the major says oh so you're dealing dope now are you i knew i was right to fire you i'm sending a few of my boys to round cluck you up to round cluck me up okay this is where we're gonna get f now my money's on mr baseball bat samurai okay combat is now engaged sir you need to go out here and, and deal with this shit Okay, let's slow it down okay there's blood people are dying chickens are dead get wrecked chicken ah samurai helmet no 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 samurai helmet that was without samurai helmet ha how you like that chicken how you like that major we have survived i think we have we have done did survive i'm not afraid of you However, I'm afraid of my staff's bladder right now. So there's that. Um, right. How much would it cost for me to do this? Yeah, I figure. Right now, we're living in the moment. We're living. We're making money so that we could buy a toilet for them. That's where we're at right now. That's our life. Holy hell, what happened here? Uh, oh yeah astronaut jack good day sir would you be willing to trade us some of your herbs i want to get higher than i than that time i went to the moon all right like mankind is making a small step but man is like leaping you know sure basic bad astronaut suit except we'd like to thank you for your sir for serving your country and science as a whole okay thank you astronaut jack very well Okay, people are very upset. Our staff is upset, rightfully so. They have the reason they have the right to be upset. It is 6 a.m. That means our laundromat is open. It's it's a go. How are we doing here? Okay, I know you're not part of the 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 I know you're not like dealing with the with the I know you're not dealing with the outside world, but you need to. Nicholas is going home. Clean or late? No, I need workers. No. Oh god, I put the cleaner I put them on cleaners. I put the workers on cleaners and the clean Oh Jesus Christ. Okay. Early shift, late shift, night shift. Oh yo yo. Okay. 
early shift. Good God almighty. Late shift. Cleaners. Cleaner late, cleaner early. Thank you. Okay. Are we good? Go up to work. You're the engineer. I know you're the engineer. We're going to have someone show up right now, right? There he is. They're, they're not. Just wait for it. They'll, they'll come. They'll come. Just, just wait for it. They'll come. Hopefully. <laughs> Where are they? Oh, no. Okay, so the fact that you can't, like, open up your schedule here to click on a shift is actually really bad. You need to be able to, like, look at your tab instead of, like, scroll through a bunch of stuff. Let's see. Let's see. So, yeah, we need you to work this, Mr. Late Shift. Okay, where are you? Follow you. That's us? Okay, that's us. Pick that thing up. Stick it in there. Very good. All right. Good Goodness gracious. We've done it. Hooray. Hallelujah. Back home. So now we can start putting stuff out. We're waiting on another call too. So we'll do that. You weren't expecting combat? Yeah. There's guns. There's traps. There's weapons. There's melee. There's everything in between. It's crazy. All right. So we'll fast forward time here. I know they're going to be very, very, very upset with us. They probably hate that there's bodies outside. I can't do anything about it. Sorry. Uh, moped now is going. Where are you going now, moped? Actually, where are you going? Are you going to? Is that the same hotline? That must be the same hotline. I guess that person's still asking for drugs. Well, I guess they've changed that a bit. It's not like boxes delivered in amount and then you're done. It looks like you could just continue to like. You can continue to um. To sell them, I guess. As long as that timer's going, uh, we we are selling cannabis now, so that's good. That that's why our money went up there. Come back over to the factory. Uh, we need to load that up. So let's load that up. Send that off to the factory. I'm having a party tonight with Evelyn. Very well. Paid per box delivery, much as possible. We will accept. Go to our map. Change Noped to to now Evelyn. There you go. Noped, you will now be heading to Evelyn when you get your boxes. And now we have a system. A system is now in place. We have enough for a bathroom. So let's, you know, put stuff in a bathroom, shall we? I know, it's incredible. Staff toilet. I know, right? Crazy. You want a sink? There's your freaking sink. You want a hand dryer? There's your freaking hand dryer. You need to go to the bathroom? Go ahead and use it. We're going to need a cleaner here too because it looks like this place is disgusting. Slowly but surely, we're getting there. Slowly but surely, we're getting there. We've generated $1,000 all together. That's good. Okay. Now we have 300 extra dollars here. I would like to generate, not generate. I would like to create another corridor. The so bathroom here. Right. Bathroom here. No, I don't, I don't, I, 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 I don't want that corridor there. Okay. I'm mapping it out in my head. I know it might look weird, but trust me. Just trust me, will you? Demolition? Don't demolish that. There we go. Yeah. Mapped out in my head. Trust me. Yep. No access to the bathroom? You're right. How, how? I don't know. How? Do, I don't. Yeah. I know what you're thinking. I know what you're thinking. How? Just how? Yeah, I, I, yeah. How? There you go. <laughs> He's running to the bathroom, dude. <laughs> He's standing in line for the bathroom. Okay, now they're hungry. Rightfully so. <laughs> okay we're making money don't worry we're still making money hopefully mopeds in all right we're getting there we're figuring it out we're figuring it out we got it we're figuring it out the new hotline isn't as is not as prof profitable as the old one. Oh, that saddens me 
so then it's going to be mostly all about business well i guess that's good uh one thing we're also going to need is an engineer because our look at our uh light our lights are actually about to break that's not good uh we don't have enough money right now to actually hire an engineer or a cleaner okay that one's being sent out to evelyn let's go take a look at the laundry business anybody coming in yet okay somebody's coming in they're gonna purchase some cannabis yeah i got that good stuff make a character starve that was an achievement i'm not proud of that one okay kitchen desperate desperate it's gonna be the smallest kitchen you've ever seen dude okay kitchen there uh yep uh ooh, baby a refrigerator i guess would be ideally and a countertop and a cutting board there's your freaking kitchen and i'm money no i don't need a corridor for that okay go run hurry yes <laughs> like the sims dude oh my god finally this human this guy gave us freaking lays chips there we go now we're feeding our people <laughs> very good <laughs> oh man i'm having a party tonight need some stuff yeah no problem we got it all right so let's go ahead and switch over our noped to that party there you go okay noped 2 is on that party might be worthwhile to get another uh, moped in here i apparently threw up or somebody threw up oh my god okay we need to hire a cleaner and an engineer next hygiene sir i have a toilet oh my god i've already killed somebody okay we've lost somebody i don't know who that was but we have lost somebody they are dead at my sink Oh, this is going wonderful. This guy's going to die next. He's got some sort of poison going on, man. Keep it together, man. Keep it together. I know this place is filthy. Absolutely filthy. I'm trying to get the money. I, I promise you. I'm trying to get the money for a cleaner. They just cost so much money. I don't know what to tell you. They're expensive. Them and their mops. Can someone send this? Can you like go to the hospital, sir? my lord okay cleaner in action now cleaners here early shift late shift factory shift factory late shift get it going let's go get it going he comes in he's like what the hell happened to this place <laughs> holy crap dude there you go all right engineer uh is next we have now broken our lamps which means we're going to be putting out bad quality one-star quality cannabis as well now oi 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 all right we're picking up the don't worry we're picking it up this man will not stop puking these did they throw food on the ground they did throw food on the ground i don't have a trash can in there or something i don't know okay this gentleman our guard is now dead from uh apparent uh Food poisoning. That's lovely. Lovely. One day of death, it happens. I'm, I'm racking up two days of death. The oregano gods are playing, right? That's right. I think it's very, very expensive to get a uh, engineer in, right? At least our workers are still like here doing their thing. $750 to get a um, engineer in play. So I think we might have to roll with the bad. Um, bad quality cannabis for now it would it does suck but i mean that's that's all i really need can i buy a trash can do i have enough to purchase a trash can let's see we're gonna get out of this don't worry about it we'll get out of this um i need kitchen trash can there we go trash can all right we'll let that go he just swept under the body nice there you go sweep that up sir there we go all right good i know people are dead but it's a clean factory so i you know what mission accomplished 
Uh, somebody is selling some stuff or wanting some stuff. This is Annabelle Harris. We will do that now. All right, switch you over. Where are you at? Right there. Oh, that's not you. Right there. Uh, Noteped 2. Please go to there. Thank you. Let's go take a look on the laundromat real quick. Okay. This is late shift. Okay, we got it. We got it. We got it. We, we have to adjust this somehow. Early shift, late shift. Where are you? Okay, you're there. So you just left. Okay. Now we can actually tell since it's late shift, let's go ahead and micromanage Noped 1 real quick. We'll take Noped 1 off of that and we'll start sending them over to the others until uh, the laundromat reopens, I think. There we go. Try to see if we can get this money in a little bit quicker. So we can get this engineer in so that we can have better quality oregano being sent out. Yeah. Was that your engineer that died? No, I think that was a uh, extra, another worker that we had that died. I'm pretty sure. I don't think it it was a worker that we died that died and a uh, bodyguard that died. Go go go! Hurry hurry hurry! Okay, no ped, no ped, no ped. Money's being sent out. There we go. Three seventy nine. Very good. They'll come back and they'll double team Annabelle at her house with these boxes. I realize what I just said. Wait a minute. And I take it back. Like that. Reverse it. Thank you. They will not double team Annabelle at her house. They will just send her boxes. Two nopeds being sent out. My bad. You know what? That's not a one star quality. It is actually a two star quality cannabis, cannabis being sent out, even with the lights being down. Not too bad. And the next thing we're going to need to do is we're going to need a staff break room. Yeah, we're going to need a staff break room or they will die to boredom. Okay, you know what? I'm not stressing about the engineer then too much right now. Let's go ahead and go staff break room. Let's build that out for right now. Staff needs. Yeah, give them like, I don't know, a freaking couch. Give them a bedroom or something or not a bedroom, a bookshelf. Lord have mercy. I'm sorry. Did I hit the wrong one? There you go. Um, staff break room. Okay. Do I have enough to buy a door? I don't. I have a couch. I have a sta staff break room that they can't even access yet. They're pissed. They said the magic is behind this wall that we can't, we can't get to. I understand. There we go. Perfect. Somewhat fun books to read. Uh, I'd rather get the TV. What does the couch do? Sitting and watching TV. How's the nopeds? Okay, no ped is out. Nobody is working though. Did I lose another worker? I can't tell. I think I might have lost another worker. Maybe I did lose another worker. Goodness gracious. Can I see cause of death, please? This is going completely wrong. I know what you need. You need you need life. You need rest. You need sleep. Okay, look. This is not good. This is not good. I'm gonna be honest with you, this is not good. I'm trying to vision us getting out of this, but I don't think there is a vision of us getting out of this. Um, this gentleman, hang on a sec. This gentleman is on the verge of death, possibly due to tiredness, maybe. Um, everything else is, I mean, he needs his fun, right? He's bored, but he's also tired. I'm trying to think of how I could do this. I don't have enough money to build, to build. 
man, how am I going to do this? I have to build a bedroom to give them a bed. But in order to build a bedroom, I'm going to need at least like three or four hundred dollars, right? Okay, this is what we do. We're going to scrape by our freaking teeth is what we're going to do. Okay, how are you on hunger and bladder? You're great. You're fan freaking tastic. Okay, look here. This is a toilet. Obviously. Um, what was that? What did I just click? What did I just click again? Look it, look it, look it, look. I know what you might be thinking. This guy is out of control. And I agree. Why does it take the object and the entire uh, tile? I agree. I agree. This guy is out of control. I agree. But when there's a way, there's a will, win, way, will. Okay. Okay. Bear with me. So I think it's possible. I think it's possible. I think it's possible. I have faith. I have faith. As long as we can micromanage them here. I know what you're thinking they need. Well, they're going to need food. Yeah, 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 yeah. Obviously, obviously. Thank you, Einstein. You're right about that. But if we can just get over the hump and get some money out that's the idea here go to bed as long as we don't lose him and he can help us that's the idea here that's the idea i will accept just anything at this point okay let him sleep let him sleep we will micromanage the hell out of him okay now he's going to be upset because he has no fun. Rightfully so. I say, go watch some TV, nerd. How about that? There you go. Oh, you don't get the TV too. Oh my God. They turned on Seinfeld. Okay, look here. You're fine. Your stats are fine. What I'm going to do, with the, it's early shift. We'll put you on the early shift. We'll get this stuff pushed out. It's time to push it out. Your factory late? No. Your factory early now. Get to work. Get to work. There you go. Yeah. There you go. There you go. Get these no peds loaded up. Yep. Get them up. Hey, okay, time out. No ped one, no ped two. Thing one, thing two. Beeline it. I don't care about the cell. Beeline it to the laundromat. Go. Before they open. All right. Continue. We find a way. Keep the faith. That's right. Keep the faith. That's right. Keep the faith. Keep it coming. Now they're going to sit here for 30 seconds. Don't worry about it. The worker will come in. They'll come. They'll see. Hi. Right. Good. Grand. Happy to see you. We'll grab it. We'll pick it up. We'll get going. Come on. Why do you show up to work late? This is ridiculous. You have to get... So you show up at 6.30. You're late to work. Maybe I need you to come in at 5. That's ridiculous, dude. That's ridiculous. I'm over here trying to run a front. And you're showing up 30 minutes late to work. Unacceptable. Here comes the money. The guy bought soap. I didn't need you to buy Tide. I need you to buy this cannabis. There you go. Perfect. 292. Love to see it. Quit, <laughs> Quit buying Tide. Please. Okay. $624. Now, what do I do with this? Very simple. I head back to my factory. I say, oh my God, I'm so sorry for taking your bathroom away and your kitchen away. However, can I, what, what can I do to help you? Right? This is what I do to help them. I bring it back. 
I bring it back. I don't need to rebuy these because I've already, I don't need to rebuy them because I already own them. So I'm not spending money there. The only thing I'm spending money on is the room, but I already own it. So that's a free placement. That's a free placement. Love to see it. All right. Now we're back in business. Yeah. Now we're back in business. Bring out the kitchen again. I don't need to rebuy these things either. Here we go. Perfect. You just got to watch and learn. All right. Watch and learn. Pay attention. Don't miss something. You blink, you miss something, right? Here we go. Bring in the trash can. Perfect. 174. And we're still selling and dealing and when working it. We're working it good. If we get attacked, I will flip the flip out. I will flip the flip out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Continue. You know what? Honestly, I'll take, I'll accept it, but I'm not going to prioritize it. Right now, I'm prioritizing the laundromat. It's early in the morning. It's time to prioritize. Now, this man is doing like the work of Christ over here. <laughs> He's got the oregano going. He's doing the mopeds. He's MVP status at this moment. He is keeping us in the game. What is your name, sir? Addison? You're keeping us in the game, Addison. You are. You're keeping us alive. Now, the next thing I would like to do is buy an engineer or hire an engineer. Yeah. Hello, Grammy Q. How's it going? Welcome in. <sighs> this is wonderful. All right, $500. We're looking good. We're looking good. We're tasting good. We're smelling good. We're sexing good. We're doing all the goods today. All right, $800. $780. Technically, that's enough to get us a um, uh, en an engineer. That was a massive purchase. I don't know how I feel about it right now. I'm kind of hurting a little bit. What time is it? I'll put you on engineer schedule so that I don't need to like pay you a lot of hours. Yeah. All right. Come on in and fix my lights so that we can have a guaranteed three quality star cannabis. Now we do have some contaminated cannabis here. That's not good. Um, Engineer, what are you doing, dude? It, what are you doing? Oh, yeah, you have like a break? No, what are you doing? Oh, you you are on break. Sorry, my bad, engineer. You're on break. I'm, I'm, my, my apologies. No! Don't. Why are you sick? Why are you sick? Why is your mouth sick? <laughs> Take care of yourself. Oh, for the love of God. Okay, they're getting sick in the kitchen. Whatever they're doing in the kitchen, it's not good. It's not good. Do I need to build a sink in there? I might need to build a sink in there so they wash their hands. Is a sink an option? You filthy animals. Oh yeah, they need a shower? That could be a good idea too. How much is that? 180? All right. All right, if he dies, it's not the end of the world. Actually, it is quietly the end of the world, probably, if he dies. He does need a shower, though. We need $180. How did you drop this right there, dude? Okay. Look here. Look here. My, my, my good man. A good man. I praised you. Now you're failing me. Okay, look here. I know you're on break. No. I know... Are you on break? Are you on break? Going to be sick? Being sick? Don't die on me, for the love of God. Okay. You know what? Look. He died. He choked to death on his vomit. Okay. Look, auto save is on. We need to reload. We need to reload. We got to reload. We have no, we have no, I just actually exited the entire game. That was not what I wanted to do. We need to reload and we need to put a shower in. Yeah, we need a shower. Hopefully this goes back about five minutes, right? And we'll be fine. As long as there's a shower in, we'll be okay.
Does everyone has gloves? No, I don't think everyone has gloves. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> it's fine. We'll be fine. I'm curious to see where they put us at the autosave, though. It's fine. We're fine. Hmm. Okay, this is really good. Auto save came, came in clutch. This is before I laid down. Okay, this is before I laid down the kitchen and before I laid down the bathroom. That's fine. That's good. Uh, so let's lay down the bathroom again. Right before I did it. Okay. And then I will make sure to put a shower in here now instead. Can I put the shower right there? Yeah. Perfect. So then that is good to go yeah i can't put a hand dryer in here though what's the hand dryer for do they really need a hand dryer i guess so i won't skip them out on it i'll give them the hand dryer can i move this let's move this hand dryer okay they're gonna need a kitchen we already know that kitchen should be fine i'll make it a little bit bigger this time 300 I'm going to need. Okay. Are you kidding me? Are you actually kidding me? I thought this was 1.0, man. How come I ran into three bugs and I've only been playing for an hour? Huh? 1.0, where are you at? Three bugs? One hour? Lord have mercy. You're killing me, Smalls. You're killing me. All right, anyways. Oh. Okay. Both of you guys go to the factory. Okay, you guys are both going to the factory. Great. This is... I'm going to have to save. And then I'm going to have to reload it. I, there's no way can't have this like bug sitting here oh my god oh my god okay so one thing i also don't like is that how come when you exit the game you can't just like go to the main menu it like kicks you out of the entire game like let me just go to the main menu i don't need to go to that right thank you luckily it loads really fast but still Okay, no bugs, please. We'll be okay. Almost, this is almost the exact replay of your first playing. I know, right? <laughs> hey, Kathy, how are you? Hey, Jenny, how are you? <laughs> Goodness gracious. Hey, a shorty girl, how are you? Good to see you. Welcome in. I guess this is time to say hello to chat. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. Here we go. Wow. Thank you. You wait. You're taking a shower. Very well. Okay. I'm gonna need three hundred dollars. We're gonna need three hundred dollars so that I can put. You know, if I get three hundred dollars, it will go into the uh, go into the kitchen. So wait till I get three hundred dollars before doing that, so I don't bug out the game. This is a cleaner. We already know we don't have an engineer yet. Uh, I, you know, that was before the save. That is contaminated cannabis. So whoever gets that, good luck. Um, yeah. All right, let's continue. So when we get three hundred, we'll place down the kitchen, and we'll get that all situated. But I think overall, this. Should be good we should, we should be just fine i know i've said that a hundred thousand times but i'm feeling more confident now okay i'm not feeling confident but i'm just trying to give you false hope i i don't know we'll, we'll see i guess we'll figure it out we'll figure it out together <sighs> let's go back to the laundromat while we wait shall we 468 dollars okay let's go back to the factory <laughs> 
Okay. All right. Okay. Kitchen. Here we go. Perfect. All right. Yeah. Nice. All right. Luckily, we don't have to rebuy this stuff. Okay. Let's go kitchen counter bridge and we'll go cutting board. Go trash can. And do I have enough for a table? I do. I technically do. It makes it so they eat faster. This one's for disposing plated food. I think I probably want a sink before a dining table. A sink before a dining table? Like, do I want them to eat faster? Or do I want them to dispose their plated food? I guess I want them to dispose their plated food. Yeah, that's what I want. Okay, so that man is hurrying as fast as he can to chop up a sandwich. So he should be able to now go to the take a shower. There you go. Good job. Good job. There you go. There we are. Did he leave the damn plate on the ground? He did. He didn't even use the sink. And he's sick again. And he he's dead again. Oh my goodness gracious. That's all right. We have enough money to hire another. Hey, that's not all right. We do not have enough money to hire another. Okay, I think that is GG for this run. <laughs> well, that didn't go as planned. Okay. <clears throat> we're just gonna... We're gonna do a new save. How about that? We're gonna relaunch. We're gonna... We're gonna go new game and this will be uh hands me please and no tutorial so just send me in yeah yeah he got out of the shower Got out of the shower, and as soon as he got out of the shower, he threw up. Yeah. Yeah, I can wait a bit before the laundromat. I well, the, okay. So the reason why I did the 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 early laundromat is basically I was trying to follow the, the program, the criminal education program, but it didn't even like matter because it didn't even like count, which kind of sucked. But okay, let's let's get it going here. All right, all right, all right, all right. Let's go factory. We want. We already okay. We, wait a sec. Yeah, factory. That one. That one. This one will be road. I want to get the extendo. We'll get the extendo. Uh, give me a road on there. Thank you. And then let's get it going. I think we should build up. Uh, build up product first and foremost. Get a system going deliver um what we need to deliver um and then just straight up build a stockpile i guess and then get the laundromat yeah all right this is going to be a little bit easier now that i can play stuff where i want and i have to follow the tutorial i guess in a way if you if you know how to play don't play the tutorial um if you don't know how to play use the tutorial but the tutorial kind of handicaps you or kind of kneecaps you a little bit um with like placement and stuff so let's see here now that i have free roam this is nice so let's go obviously oops obviously this we want two mopeds i want it up against the sidewalk unlike the tutorial and then i would like to do i would like to build a corridor how do I want to do this? I think I want to build the corridor like this across. One down this way. And then do a grow room right here. 
for a thousand please trebek thank you actually i would like the grow room to kind of expand out even more actually you know what i don't want that there can i change that i want this to be the storeroom right here and then you know what can i demolish this corridor here i'll just get rid of that I'll demolish that and i'll go storeroom right here and then I'll go grow room. One, okay, wait. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Okay. Is this looking better? Because you also had to like prepare for the future as well. Okay. So far so good, I feel. Okay. First things first, we want a door right there. Thank you, Chingy. I want a door right there. Door right there. Okay. And then um <clears throat> Okay. Do something like that. Okay. And then we'll do a staff break room over here. Relatively bigger. Not too big though. Okay, wait a sec. Uh one okay, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two. Okay. There we go. You know what? Actually, we'll go like that. Kitchen. Uh, I don't want them to travel too far away to use the bathroom, actually. So let's go bathroom that one instead. Kitchen is fine, and then we'll go break room right here. Bedroom right here. Four door down. Four door down. Doors. Door there. Door there. Uh, I hate that you can't do like back to back, but that's fine. That's all right. A door there. A door there. A door there. And a door there. Okay. That looks a little bit more efficient, even though this is like doorway hell. That looks a lot better. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, work ourselves. See, this is what happens when I don't like have to worry about a tutorial telling me where to put stuff in this and that and that and this, right? Um, we'll go boom. TV. No pool table. No pool table. Trash can. Arcade cabinet. Coffee machine, soda machine. That's your staff break room. This is your bathroom, right? Uh, we'll go boom, boom, boom. Don't forget a shower. Sync me up. Air dry, hand dry. Ay, 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 ay. I need a hand dry. Do I need two showers though? Do that. That's fine. All right, so that's taken care of. Let's go to bedroom. Should be straightforward. That's good. An even nicer bed. Slow recovering energy. Wait a sec. I don't want them to be slow. I'll go for, I guess, expensiver. <laughs> expensiver. That's fine. Kitchen. Uh, kitchen table. Kitchen counter. Cutting board. Refrigerator. Uh, stove. Sink. Think. 
counter. Coffee? All right, that's looking pretty good. And then the grow room itself. Let's get that rolling. Yes. One, two, three. Uh, four, five, maybe. I don't know how I want to do this. Actually, push forward. That's what I want to do. Perfect. Come on to the back side. Back side of water. Also perfect. I think. Actually, I don't know. That's not going to work, huh? Um, let's actually get rid of these ones. We'll go like this. There we go. That that should work. Briar. Okay. A cutting board. I'll actually swap those positions. Cutting board's closer to the door. Or the dryers. Yeah, cutting board's closer to the door. Okay. And then we need lights. Camera. Freaking action. Okay. And then we need to tone these down a bit. To 50. There we go. All right. I'm not going to use this grow room right now. This is for uh, toasted in the future. So that's a future grow room. I'm not using it right now. Storage. Okay. Boxing. we go all right how we doing we're looking good are we doing good hey les how you doing les what's going on okay i think i think what this is a good start yeah this is a good start let me go ahead and get landscaping in because i can't i don't like this like texture right there good start yeah okay now we got to do the hard part we gotta do the hard part. Freaking scheduling in the employees. So, uh, how many? Uh, eight, sixteen. Okay, we want three shifts. Okay, we want three shifts, right? Um, workers. Okay, I want eight, sixteen, twenty-four. That's the shifts I want. Eight, sixteen, twenty-four. Okay, let's see, let's see. Okay, schedule one. Early. Oh. Factory, early. Factory, noon. Uh, actually, factory, evening and factory night so early I'm trying to think of like real shifts in real life okay 6 a.m nine hours okay one two three one two three four one, two, three. We, the, we don't want them to die on us, right? Obviously. Fifteen hundred. Okay. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. We want to keep them. We don't want them to die. Even if that means there's an hour where nobody's working, that's fine. Okay, I kind of like that. Are we good with that? Are we good with that? I think so. <sighs> Early. Evening. Night. And I'll adjust it. I'll adjust it as well. Hey, Candy Girl. How you doing, Candy Girl? Okay, engineer. Cleaner. 
Guard. Okay, schedule for engineer. Engineers don't need to work 24 seven. We'll give them a three hour hit there. Actually, we'll give them a four hour hit there and then they'll do nothing, do nothing, do nothing. And then they'll have a morning and an evening kind of shift like that. Exactly what they'll do. That's the engineer. And that probably goes both ways on like this and the commercial businesses as well. So engineer. Next, uh, cleaner. Honestly, the cleaner. The cleaner could just use factory night and factory early. Maybe we'll just do that for the cleaner guard. Honestly, I don't even know. <laughs> um, so you, my good man are on engineer, right? This is it. No, this is a guard. Damn it. Okay. Engineer is on engineer guard is on. Honestly, guards going to have their own schedule. Guard. Something like that. It's just chaos throughout the day. At least they're around, right? Right? Okay. Um, guard, you are going to be on guard. Cleaners. I'm going to have a cleaner. Oh, I need to hire. I need to purchase another land to hire more people. That's fine. Cleaner, I'll just have in the morning. Engineer, I'll have on engineer. Workers seem to be doing good. I'm not going to buy another piece of land. I'm going to see how this works first. And we'll go there. Okay. Right. Um. Moped. Well, mopeds. Oh, wait. We need to do hotline. Oh, I forgot to do this. We got to do this. Okay. We got to get the hotline in. Hotline is in. So now we can deliver. Okay. I think we're good. Let's get people in and working now. Oh, you know what I'll do now is I'll actually, um, I'll purchase some things for them too. Now, I don't know who is who. So Jackson, let's purchase stuff for our factory people. Hey, okay, Jackson, let's give you a scientist helmet for 800. I shouldn't have done scientists. Honestly, I shouldn't have done that. I, sh I really shouldn't have garden gloves. I think movement speed is good for them. Okay, let's go Jose. Jose. Um, garden gloves and athletic feet and Evelyn 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 garden gloves ass feet okay I think those are good purchases for them as long as we got them working and doing their thing oh look at them they're lightning speed now look how fast they are <laughs> all right okay now I only have two beds. I wonder how much it would cost. Hang on. How much would it cost to expand the land? The direction I want it to go. $11,000. Goodness gracious. That's a lot of money. All right, here we go. Check the engineer. What's the, uh, is the engineer? What's the engineer? Hang on. Let me see. Engineer. Uh, la, 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 la.
What's wrong with the engineer? Oh, you're right. There we go. Thank you. Hmm. That's a good idea too. So since we don't have a business open, we should probably have some of our drugs going to places where uh, we can get and um, we can unlock stuff. So let me see if I can find the menu for this. Okay, so this for an example. If we send uh, cannabis to the university, we can unlock toasted. If we send it to the gun shop, we can unlock a machete or a riot shield. If we send it to the scrapyard, we can unlock the cars. And the cars hold four boxes and the mopeds hold one box. So yeah, we should do exactly that. We should start sending at least one moped or in this case, noped one. We'll start sending noped one to uh, the scrapyard. We'll kind of have that going passively. So noped one, go to the scrapyard. Noped two, you are pending right now. There we go. Okay. Midnight, so we should have somebody working, right? One AM, we should have somebody working, right? Factory night looking for work. Um, Evelyn. Oh, I have to tell them to do the ta oh my god, I'm task me. Task me. Just task me. Oh. Alright. Everyone to work. Get to work. There we go. Thank you. Goodness gracious. Hey Moonchild, how are you? Good to see you. Welcome in. I would like that engineer and like that engineer job at IRL. <laughs> All right. So, uh, one thing I want to, I want to look in this is, can you see in this game if like, can you see a Can you see if, um, is there like a, oh, I got to turn on the hotline. That would help. Is there like a stats thing saying like, oh yeah, you have, um, uh, you know, your, your daily is this or your daily is that I'm having a party tonight. Oh yeah, the re-ups are in. It's 5 p.m. on the West Coast here, ladies and gentlemen. So the re-ups came in. Appreciate that. Thank you very much to all those people that re up their memberships. Thank you. Thank you for that. Thank you. Big ups to y'all. Oh, there's no let. There's no wait. <laughs> no ledger in the game yet. Yet. There's no ledger in the game yet. So there's going to be a ledger in the game. And you're telling me it's not in the game yet. What the frick? The ledger needs to be in the game in 1.0. Are they sure this is 1.0? Are they sure? Are they positive? This is 1.0? I don't know, man. Are they fooling us? I don't know. <laughs> mm-hmm. All right, we'll let this go through. 
let this go a little bit faster. Uh, right now, what we're doing is all we're doing simply is just building up our storage and then we'll kind of micromanage and maybe get another moped or two or something in. But really, all I'm doing is just kind of uh, building up this now. Now, why is nobody working? I couldn't tell you. We'll wait. Maybe it's just a break hour. Okay. Yeah, it was just a break hour. That's fine. We give them a break hour. That's fine. That's fine. We can't freak out about that. Good to see Danielle has re-upped her membership. I know, right? <laughs> yeah, she read up her membership for 22 months. 22 months? Holy hell. Art Vandalay for 27 months. Goodness gracious. My lord. Some people are working on three years. All right, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. That's exactly what we want right there. That's exactly what we want. All right, box it up. Send it off in the moped. I don't care. Do whatever you want to do. Really? We also might... Uh, it might benefit from more workers here. Like, doubling down. Maybe have an extra three. Maybe... No, wait, we can't. Because we can't hire anymore until we get more land, huh? That's right. Right, no pet too. Um, I need you to go there. I know it might be not a lot to make money from the deliveries, but I think we need to have some sort of oh shit. So you're dealing dope now, are you? I knew I was right to fire you. I'm sending a few of my boys to cluck you up. I forgot about this. Please don't kill any of my guys. You're gonna kill my engineer or cleaner, are you? I never hired a bodyguard, did I? I thought I did. Maybe I didn't. All right, one worker's dead. Go away! Go away! Two! God. Rude chickens. All right, who did we lose? Was that a cleaner we lost? We lost a cleaner. Okay, that's fine. Whatever. We knew it was going to come, but I thought I, I thought I hired... I did hire a guard. Where the frick was he? That son of a gun. Uh, we'll just do factory early for the guy. And then we hired... We lost a morning shift. Factory worker. Okay. Early night evening. Okay. Adrian Thompson. I'm about to rebuy your stuff, ain't I? So the I mean honestly the guard didn't do anything for us. I don't know if he was maybe he was on a break, you know? We were on a break, right, Ross? I don't know. Alright, back to back to business as usual. We spent quite a bit of money, more than I would have liked to, but that's fine. Good day, sir. Would you be willing to trade us some of your herbs? I want to, yeah, 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 yeah. I want to, Mr. Jack. I can start sending stuff to Jack, too. Did I have to, wait, reset ta Oh, yeah, I had to reset tasks. That's right. Goodness gracious. Ay, ay, ay. Okay, you do that, and you do that. By default, never mind. Maybe not. Do I have to do you? No, you're, you're fine, right? You, uh, yeah, okay. Okay, continue. Anyways, before we got rudely interrupted by a bunch of chickens, we have some stuff sitting in the storage, so that's good. Um, I wish there was like select all kind of thing. That's fine. There we go. No ped coming in. No ped. All right. As far as like where we're at with the scrapyard, we have three points. We have three points. <laughs> three points out of 90. Um, to build a laundromat, it's going to take a very long time now. Because I think it costs 3000 or 4000 to actually get the... Um, actually get the uh, business, right? Yeah, 3000 to get the business license. And then we have to buy the plot and then buy all the stuff that comes along with it. So I think really the only money-making thing that we can do is just do deliveries. That's it. 
Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Problem, the deliveries take so long, you will barely get one delivery and only one and so one package of profit of $160. Yeah. That's true. The profit margin is probably very, 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 very small. That's why I feel like having that laundromat early is probably like ideal, right? Because you got to have that thing or it's going to be a, going to be a long road, isn't it? Uh, Noped 2. I mean, I could send out both Nopeds to, uh, to the, um, to the hotline, I guess. Yeah. You have to have the laundry to start. Great. Okay. We'll work with these mopeds here. We'll see them through. Um, well, actually, I guess we can have like a bunch of mopeds out. Maybe if we have a bunch of mopeds, maybe four mopeds. Maybe we can make enough money to keep going with the hotlines. I don't know. We'll have to see. We could buy the license right now if we wanted to. And you know what? I'm going to do that, actually. I know it's kind of like, what are you doing? You have 3K and you're going to decide to do that. The reason is, is if we sit at like a zero dollar, kind of, we can kind of see if we are being profitable in what we're doing since we have no freaking ledger, which is incredible. So this might be dumb. Can I save? We'll save and turn off um, auto save. I'm going to make this decision. We'll purchase the license, even though we can't build on it. We'll start at a kind of zero dollar and we'll see what we're doing right now. If it's profitable by sending two mopeds to hotlines. We'll see if we can do that. I guess that's a, a, a way. We'll do that. And if we... We could throw in an extra moped too. Mopeds are not expensive. I think they're like $250, right? So we can also get another moped as well. And we'll see what we'll see if we can be profitable with mopeds going out to hotline. Mm -mm -mm. Everything else is taken care of. Schedules are taken care of. Food is taken care of. Hygiene's taken care of. Bathroom is taken care of. Beds are taken care of. They're all taken care of. Mm. Mm. Okay, you eat, go eat, eat, eat. The only problem here is how fast we can get these, uh, get these guys out. Now, what I'm gonna do, okay, this is what I'm gonna do. Since we, you know, got our, you know, shit kicked in, I'm just gonna fire the guard. I'll fire the guard. $112 extra for us and then we can hire a worker uh, for 500 when that time comes if we get to that part because um, if so I'll just have a worker that just dedicates his shift to just uh, just putting boxes into the cars into the mopeds and maybe we can go faster that way too okay now let's go ahead and do this and go you go there you go there go that way I'm not worrying about the guard. We'll save $120 a day. So be it. All right, we'll slowly see how this goes. Now that we're saving money with $120 a day, we need a cleaner. We could trim hours, maybe, but we need a cleaner. We need an engineer if we want to make three-star quality uh, cannabis, right? Okay, your energy's going low. That's okay. Interesting. We haven't eaten the storage box yet. So we have like, no, we don't. We have one box and a couple waiting to be dried out and then cut up. Okay, now we're making a we're making some money here now. As long as we can get these things out as fast as possible. Yeah. Yeah, we'll see if 
we'll see if these things offset um i think as soon as i can i'm gonna i'm going to buy another moped as soon as i can uh how much is that again uh garage 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 250 right yeah 250 250 plus 75 dollars a day we'll see yeah there we go i just need the faster we can get the mopeds out the better and then i have an extra slot right now i have an extra slot to hire a worker if i want to there we go there we go keeping them coming keeping them coming we got two boxes if i have the extra slot i can have a worker just Ten boxes out. Boom, boom, boom. That's all he does. That's only if we get like a backload of product here. Having a party tonight, baby. All right, very well. Okay, let's see. You are there, so let's go. You there, you there. Okay, go. Hey, Jennifer. How you doing, Jennifer? Good to see you. Thank you for the super chat. Hope you're doing well, Jennifer. Hope you're doing well. Good to see ya. All right. We could take a look at the map too and watch them and see how they drive. Or like drive like a holes. Keep it coming. Drive, 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 drive. Okay, here comes some money. This will actually get us over the 250 mark, I think. Right? Come on, baby. 299. 300 and buy another moped or I could save up for a worker I'm buying another moped I'm going moped we're going moped we're going moped and we're hoping for the best here okay mopeds in we'll call this one noped three here we go more and more Get it out, get it out, get it out. You also go there now. Of course, this is like the one time that I think everybody's on break right now. Take those boxes out. Yep, there you go. One box there. Take another box out. I like how they prioritize boxes over than like doing the cutting and all that. But I do like that. We're doing the plants. All right. We're good. We're doing good. I feel it. Do you feel it now, Mr. Krabs? Now, I don't think the astronaut gives us money, right? The astronaut gives us the astronaut suit. And I forgot what the astronaut suit does. If I'm completely honest. And now those bad boys are going out. Yeah, this is where the money comes in, right? Hopefully. Fingers crossed. I don't know if I have enough room to put another moped. I might. I might have another room. More room. Okay. If we see empty garages, that's a good sign, right? Okay. Here we go. Moped. Go there. Moped. Go there. Moped. Here we go. Astronaut suit is hazmat. Okay, good shout. Floatery B. Floatery B. What are you doing? What's going on, Floatery B? Five gifted memberships handed out there. Look at that. Thank you, Floatery B. I appreciate you. That was very kind of you. Hope you're doing well on this Wednesday. Happy hump day indeed. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you, Floatery B. Very kind of you. Okay, 3.45. We can slide another one in there, but I think I'm going to wait. It's not like we have like product ready to go yet. We only have one box barely ready to go. You know what? Actually, I'm going against my... You know what? Hang on. Let's save. <laughs> Let's save first. Go against the grain. There we go. This is no ped 4. Oh, whoops. Whoops. Oped four. Okay. 
Get it going. Let's go. And then when someone's on the on the on the clock, they'll put that box in the notepad. Yeah. There we go. Good stuff. Good stuff. All right. Four mopeds out delivering stuff. All right. Very good. And we're still boxing and boxing and boxing. Good, good, good. I think we got a good system here. There we go. Another moped out and about. I think we have got a good system here. It would be better to have another worker, maybe. Yeah. God, I wish we had like some sort of like some sort of like give me my stats. Like, let me see. Let me see that my daily profits, you know. That's a lot of cannabis right now. That's drying out. A lot of cannabis drying out. That's good. 474. We're, we're doing good. We're doing good. Hey, Lady Lucifer. How are you? Thank you for the re-up, Lady Lucifer. How are you doing? Good to see you. Also, another thing that kind of uh, I got to think about, too, is like when there is a thing way out over here on the map, it's going to be longer before we get our money. When things are closer, it's going to be quicker to get our money, right? So, all that good stuff. Okay, everybody go out. Uh, let's do that. Close them up. Collapse them. There go. Okay. Perfect. Almost 600. All right. All right, here we go. Ready? I think I'm going to make a move here. I think I'm going to hire another worker. And this guy be... Well, if I hire one worker, what shift am I going to put him on? I want to put him strictly for boxing. Because it would at least... Maybe not. Maybe not. But too soon. Too soon. Too soon. Too soon. Back out. Back out. Alt tab, alt tab. There we go. There we go. Too soon. Wait till you get a little bit of a cushion, yeah? Wait till you get a little bit of a cushion. Yeah. I'll save it, yeah, save it. Save it before I do anything drastic, right? Before I hire somebody, right? Because the time that he's cutting, or the time that he's boxing, he could be cutting the other stuff, you know? In a perfect world, I would like two workers working on every shift, so all three shifts. One does boxes, one does cutting. You should be fine. Eight hundred dollars. Okay, we're almost at a thousand. We've almost built it up here, and we do have the business license. I forgot how much. Did this one? Okay, Three thousand dollars for that for the actual plot for the business. If we wanted to go that route, or when we go that route. Nine hundred and twenty. Everybody's kind of like taking a break, doing their thing, making a little dance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Back to watering. What the hell just happened? <laughs> Smoke beds pulled out and went back in. All right. Yeah, let's get this going. I wish I could like select all, but yeah, that's a far out one. That's not good. Go. Okay, it's all about getting. It's all about staying above the water here. Staying above. All right. I think what I'm going to do is I think I might, I might, um, I might hire another worker, but I'm going to try to plan it on a schedule that just starts. So let me look at my schedule. Uh, employees schedule. So factory early. The so six, eight, what time is it? 2200, 2200. 
Okay, factory night starts at that. So maybe I'll do factory night and I'll hire a new worker right now. I'll put them on factory night. Factory night. We'll have them do shipment only. And then my other factory night person will do cutting only. And we'll see if that helps or anything. Okay. We'll see that shift. We'll watch that shift go. So now for the night shift starting at midnight, we will have one cutter and one boxer. And maybe that will make production go smoother and faster. I spent $500 for that worker. So we're going to find out here in a sec. Sorry. When I mean boxer, I mean, uh, like, yeah, putting the boxer to the moped. I didn't mean, like, I guess, I guess I should have reworded that. Not like, uh, I'm gonna, you know, actually have someone grab it and then box it up. I meant someone to put the, put the stuff away. Yeah. Or put the stuff out, out and about. So this guy will be there. He's doing his thing. It trims time, but I don't know if it trims a lot of time. Let's see. Let's see. Go start moving these guys over. Is it worth the time that it trims? Is it, I guess that's the, that's the, what we, you know, I mean, I don't know. You know what? Actually, you know what? I'm just going to say, screw it, dude. He's going to do, they're going to do both. We'll do both. We'll just do both. I, I don't, you know, that, that that's reasonable, I guess. Right. And you know what? What I'm going to do actually is I'm going to change this guy's schedule. We're going to make another schedule. This is going to be factory. Factory. Universal. Factory uni. But factory uni is going to do factory uni is going to kind of touch a little bit of everything. Um, what time is it? 3 a.m. Okay, 3 a.m. You'll work at 3 a.m. 2 a.m. One, two, three, four, five. do something like that so that kind of touches every shift that's what I'm thinking we'll try that back three uni go at it go hard <laughs> All right. Okay. As long as the factory uni universal utility, whatever you want to call them, they can touch every shift. They can help out everybody on their shifts and make things maybe go a little bit faster. That's what I'm thinking. Have a good one, Susie. Do take care. Thanks for hanging out with us. Have a good rest of your evening. See you, Susie. You take care. All right. Doing well, doing well. Look at that. They're going out fast, yeah? They're doing a decent job. There we go. Having two people work it. That seems pretty good to me. Will this make money faster? Will this put stuff in the uh, storage faster as well? I think so. Yes, yes, yes.
All right, let's do it. Switch it up. Oh my God. They're still far away. Flip Washington. What the heck does that mean, sir? What is that? Flip Wash. Oh, is that the name of the person? Oh, that's the name of the person that asked for it. Sorry. <laughs> like, what kind of action is Flip Washington? Never mind. We're good. They were driving to the gentleman. Not doing an action. All right. All right. So, I guess our next major goal is going to be. What is it? Next major goal is $3,000 to buy the plot of land. Can you actually hide? Man. Oh, very good. Okay. I was just seeing if you could hide stuff. You certainly, certainly can. So, so far, Nobody's getting sick. Nobody is dying. Right? Good day in the hood, <laughs> I guess. Nobody's choking on their vomit. Nobody's dying at the sink. So far, so good. Zero, zero, well, I guess zero deaths in my hands but i guess one death in the hands of the chicken so far so good yeah i know the storage room is very very big right the storage room is big but um the reason why it's big is because it's a future proof i'm trying to future proof myself a bit because when things start to get like crazy you start to get more stuff more stuff more stuff you're gonna get you're gonna need a big storage room so this is kind of like i don't want to say it's like end game storage but it's like almost like oh i've built an end game storage so to speak all right oh this one is right across the street that's perfect perfect somebody was going to the scrapyard hello all right look at that cash roll in baby this is how you do it zero days since the last accident there you go all right. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I'm happy with it. I'm I'm very pleased. I'm I know like the beginning was like rough, but I'm gonna be a sour puss and I'm gonna blame it on the the tutorial. So sorry tutorial, get out of my way. And also blame it on bugs. Cause why not because i can these i don't i could care less right now about the educational programs look at that this is a work of art so the next thing we want to do is we want to get toasted in that's going to be another goal um which is actually not too far away um we just send 20 cannabis to the university and we can get uh, toasted in. The only tricky thing is, is like getting the toasted in and then like you have to get the tools also to work it. So like maybe heat lamps or heaters and stuff like that to actually toast the toast the cannabis. That's the only tricky thing that. So if we go to toasted, we're going to have to go even further with toasted and like unlock other stuff and stuff like that. Blame it on the M key. Yeah, I'll blame it on the M key. Exactly. Blame it on the M key. <laughs> blame it on the M key. <laughs> Need some more stuff. We got you coming right up. Okay. Go there. Go there. That's not too far away either. So that's nice. There we go. Almost hit 2000 now. Almost hit 2,000. On your way. Out you go. It's like the little, like, mopeds from, like, Willy Wonka. Or, sorry. Let me rephrase that. Like the uh, mopeds from Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. The one with Johnny Depp. Then I'm out. Willy, Willy Wonka. Gene Wilder edition did not have any mopeds in it. Here we go. Can we break 2,000? I think we can. 
We're on day two? That's it? Holy crap. Oh, so good. Don't blame it on the sunshine. Don't blame it on the moonlight. Don't blame it on the good times. Blame it on the boogie. Like boogie in the... Uh... <laughs> like boogie in your butt? By Eddie Murphy? I know that wasn't it, but... <laughs> Uh-oh. No, no, no. Someone throw up? We good or we... Nobody's throwing up. Okay, good, good. It all starts back at home. We almost have $3,000 now. Oh, my Lanta, you are my woman. My goodness gracious. Have you ever heard boogie in the butt? No? A boogie, or, right? Is a boogie in your butt? Put a tree in your butt. A bumblebee in your butt. Put me in your butt. No? All right. Okay. Next. Okay. Not too far away again. Oh, wait. No, 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 no. This is far away. Oh, frick. <laughs> this is actually far away. Whoops. My girl likes to party all the time, party all the time, party all the time. My girl likes to party all the time, party all the time. You've never heard Eddie Murphy with a boogie in the butt? Look it up. Look it up. I think Eddie Murphy was dropping albums in the 80s. Late 80s? I don't think the early 90s. I think it was during his Beverly Hills Cop times. We have three boxes ready to go, but we have a little bit of a far out delivery here. It's back from my childhood. <laughs> I don't know what came first. I don't know if, I don't know if Eddie Murphy singing. I forgot his, I forgot the album's name. I don't know if the album came first or if, uh, the Beverly Hills Cop came first. I think I think Eddie Murphy Raw came before all that. I think. Okay, almost. I think I'm I'm gonna stay close here. And I'm just going to wait till I get 3k. I'm going to buy the plot and then I'm going to start building on the laundromat. Yeah. So, okay. Eddie Murphy Raw came first before the album. Okay. That makes sense. Dun, 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 All right. I'm having a party tonight. Yeah. Bring the good stuff. Uh, right across the street, just about. I love it. There you go. I need another cutter. No, I think the cutter's good. I think we're good. There's not so much that's, uh, that's waiting on the drying rack. Once it's done on the drying rack, then it can go to the cutter. So we don't really have a backlog there. We actually are starting to get a backlog of boxes here, but that's only because the deliveries were out so so far. I'll save it. I'll turn on auto save too for now. I'm not, I haven't made any drastic decisions. So I'll leave that on for now. If I make a drastic decision that I think is very, very questionable, I'll turn it back off. I used to sneak my Eddie Murphy cassette tapes so my mom wouldn't take them from me. <laughs> oh, man. That makes me smile. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> that makes me smile. Okay, 
almost 3k almost 3k oh also what do we have for monuments 5k is the cheapest one yeah 5k is the cheapest one okay uh get ready for the land plot purchase here it's gonna happen the fact that we have a steady business steady hours steady everything everything is steady with no problems no hunger problems no food problems no sleep problems no boredom problems no bathroom problems we're on a very steady line here and that's what matters next noped go there okay i'm gonna buy the plot of land as soon as we get 3k i don't think i'm gonna save because i think everything is fine or i don't think i'm gonna turn off auto save because i think once i buy the plot it will be okay it's not very a drastic decision to buy the that land plot i don't think because everything's running so smoothly but of course it could like all burn to hell dryer looks full might be it might look that way because the boxes are here maybe the boxes are kind of confusing people with that but like right now you have to wait for them to dry and then usually when they're done drying they're pretty good at like grabbing it real quick okay 3200 hang on a sec i'll show like when the dryer is set or when they're dried out they're pretty good at going to the cutting board there you go there you go they're double fisting it right so yeah i think it's good um yeah let's just go ahead and uh, buy this plot now all right this will be a, a laundromat that will be that so we have a land we have a license we have that we technically have a laundromat now so that's slowly but surely the beginning of something good yeah yeah we'll be good we'll be good we'll be good take the boxes out there you go take care yeah 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 okay good 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 oh i'm so happy basic all right where's the next one at oh dang it okay this this is this potentially could lose us some money here because it's so far away but we have to deal with it i guess we have to deal with it the sound of the waters are like i i don't know if it's the water that's giving me a headache or a pew 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 arcade machines giving me a headache all right all right all right okay all right we're doing good we're doing good this is so exciting i'm so happy about this i'm happy that it's working the way i want it to at least it's working the way i i, I hope it would do i i hope it would right now as far as laundromat goes um how much is it gonna cost right i think what we do is we build storeroom and then build ourselves out from there so that's too much too much too much too much Okay, can I get rid of that? Fly on me. Driving me nuts. We have a thousand dollars? I want this to go like right here. Okay. Now that we have that. Okay. Um. It doesn't need to be big here. The laundromat or the store, right? Los Polos Canzolones. No, Canzolonos. I was thinking El Polo Loco there for a sec. Danielle Turner has a party coming up. We shall give her what she needs. Just across the street. Perfect. Good. Okay. Staff toilet. I 
Okay. Break room. Okay. Okay. I know I, I, I might be expanding too fast. I might be. I might be. I might be. I might be. But we're all right. Yeah. Have a great day, Shay. Do take care. Have a wonderful rest of your, your wonder your day. Wonderful, uh, frick me. Have a re wonderful rest of your evening. There we go. I got it out of my mouth. I apologize. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out with us. Okay, three hundred. Okay. Oh, I'm I'm super I'm being super aggressive right now, ain't I? Ain't I? I am. I'm being a little sucker. I'm sucker for love. Oh, I'm a son of a gun, ain't I? I know. You get all this money and you burn it away. You spend it on fancy record players. How dare you? Don't go be spending your money on a fancy record player now. All right, you got another party? I'm here to load it up. Let's go. Continue, continue. Hey, Kyla. How are you, Kyla? How are you? Good to see you. Hey, Rudy. How you doing, Rudy? What's going on? Welcome in. Welcome in. Da -da -da -da. Okay. You know what? Head back to the laundromat. I know there's money coming. I do. Come on, come on, come on. Hit it. Hit me. Hit me. Thank you. Hit me. Hit me. Thank you. Back home. Just making sure our boxes are still staying out there. We, we got a wonderful system here. This is a profitable, profitable system. Slowly but surely, it inching our way, yeah? Hit me. Hit me. Good job. Hit me. Okay. Now let's start doing the insides. Is something I never thought I would ever say out loud. Let's go back. How much is this? $50? Are you robbing me, dude? $50 for this counter? Okay, next. Go there. Go there. Go there. Go there. Okay. Wonderful. Boom. Boom. I have 16 cents. Put that one in. Oh, now I don't. Put that in your pipe and smoke it. All right. Hey. <laughs> independent generate 10 grand. Thank you. I've always wanted to be an independent woman. Wonderful. All right. Oh, how much is that bad boy? $75? Oh, I have $69. There we go. There we go. Oh, this is going so well. So well. We are going so well. Okay. Okay. Uh, 181. Uh, how much is register? 150? Next. 
Come on. Next. Rick. I'm going to need to make a staff, uh, or not a staff, a customer toilet, too. Okay, let's go back home. How are we doing? We all right? How's, how's business? How's cannabis? How's cutting? Looks like you're a little short. Come on. Roll it out. Roll it out. There we go. 123 came in. Perfect. Smooth operator. I'm having a party tonight. Same, dude. I'm bringing dominoes. Oh, crap. You're so far away. Not a party without dominoes, man. All right. Let's work on the other stuff real quick. $100. Let's not work on the other stuff real quick. Uh, two fifty for a toilet? Ay, yeah, yeah. All right, very well. I feel you. I'll wait for some money to roll in. I'll wait. I'll wait. I'll be. I'll be patient. I'll be patient. I can't believe I'm only on day four. I feel like, well, I guess I did start over, right? Day three sixty-eight. Let me pause it real quick. Come back over here so I don't lose it. think I got no hand dryer does it matter maybe maybe not I don't know if a hand dryer really matters that much I don't know what the hand dryer does other than dries your hand sometimes when we're socially awkward in a public bathroom and there's a line at the hand dryer we just walk out and just use our pants let's be real here TV we go keep it coming <laughs> this is actually kind of cool i like that we're building out the laundry mat very slow very slow very slowly come on two boxes can be sent out already come on two boxes can be sent out somebody get on that sir why are you not on that prioritize the box come on we got two of them. You're cutting up. I'm not liking this. You need to go out now. Thank you. Other guy coming in. Okay. Next party. Across the street. Lovely. Okay. That works out. Back home. We're back to the laundromat. Okay. Let's put some... Uh, well... I mean, one TV in there is fine. Maybe to start out with. Possibly. One register should be okay, too. Two shelves should be fine early on. Next thing is, like, the actual legitimate part of the wa of this, like, a washing machine. I might need to expand this out a little bit more, though. Yeah, I might need to expand out the walls a bit more. Oh, there was almost a car accident there. Let's push this out more. And a customer door. That's true. Mm -hmm. Once you get the laundry open, stock those shelves and F the online orders for a bit. Yeah, I, I agree. Or you could go like three... Three mopeds to... Uh, you could go three mopeds to laundromat, one moped to like the scrapyard or something. You could do something like that or like, or maybe to the university for toasted. Something like that. I'm feeling toasted maybe before cars. That's what I'm thinking. Because if we can get more money quicker. Um, I feel like even if we had a car, I mean, we're not producing enough boxes to fill up a car right now, you know? All right, let's do more. Perfect. One more. Step that. Uh, this right there. There we go. I think right now what we need to worry about is all... Oh, we, we need a customer bathroom, huh? Frick. We need to worry about um, trying to maximize our, our profits. Yeah. 
yeah i think what i'll do is i'll do once we get the laundry up i'll do like three two laundry mat one moped to the university or something come on baby come on take us back home artificial light sprinklers don't come in until later you have to, it takes I think it's sec to get sprinklers in right yeah sprinklers are like end game stuff There we go. Hey, CC, how are you, CC? What's going on? Hey, CC, thank you for re upping your membership. How are you doing, CC? What's going on? I hope you're doing well. Hope you're doing well, yeah? Hey. Ah. Ah, I'm good. How have you been? Have you been doing good? Yeah. Up there. Ah, long drive, long drive. There we go. There we go. Come on, come on, come on. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I need a door. I need a door. Yeah, I need a door. How much is a door? $45? I need $45. That's it. $45 and then I need to do the washer, dryer, the benches. And then, um... Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then <laughs> the employees and all that. That's a whole nother thing. That's a whole nother thing. So how much are these? 120, 120. So 120 each. Washer. How are we doing here? Are we still cutting? Okay, we have no more in the storage. That's fine. But we have no moped, so that's... I mean, it might seem like, oh my god. Okay, now we have a moped. Never mind everything that I was about to say. I'm just gonna... Disregard. Just re Just... Never mind. Don't listen to me. Uh, yes. Let's go here. Go. No. Briar? That's... I mean, technically, that, that'd be good enough, but... I don't want that to be good enough. I want that to be, I want there to be more to that. More to that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One seventy nine. Do I want to go a whole nother row or do I not? I have to put a bench down regardless. I want to go one more. I think I do. I think I do want to go one more. Yeah, I think I do. All right. This one's a lot closer, so this should give us money faster. Okay. Everyone reroute. And then let's see. Let's see. This is 600 to 1900. Okay. I'm trying to plan ahead here. I want to do one more washer, one more dryer. Yeah, one more washer, one more dryer and I'll be good. And then I'll I'll look into employees next and start uh hiring people and then we'll start sending our uh product over there. Yeah. I got a new boss and things have been pretty rocky. So I've been working 12 hour shifts every day. I miss everyone. Oh my Lord. Man, that is tough. I'm sorry to hear that. Getting a new boss. That can always be fright. That could always be a good thing and a bad thing, right? A good thing or a bad thing. 
Okay. All right. Okay, the next thing I'm going to need to do is I'm going to need to get $500 to hire people. Now, what I can do to kind of plan this ahead is I can work out schedules already. So let's add a new schedule. This will be called uh, launder. We'll just call launder. Launder. How long is it? 600 to 1900. How many hours is that? One, two, three, four, five. Let's do launder early and then launder late. We'll have two shifts. So I want the guy to come in at 5 a.m. because we know they come in late at 6. So come in at break time for that. And then at 6 a.m. you start working. I think I can get away with six hours of work. Six hours straight of work. I think I could. And then we'll do launder late. And then this will go. They'll come in at 11 a.m. And they'll work at 12. Oh, frick. Uh, that's not going to go exactly how I planned. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. So then two hours. I think I can go eight hours straight. <laughs> or can I split it seven and seven? Maybe I could split it seven and seven. I guess we could try. There we go. Launder early, launder late. So six through 11. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, yeah. Seven hours straight for both. We can test it. Yeah, we can test it. And I think I can make a cleaner do that too. So we'll leave that as is. And then we'll just wait till we get $500. Yeah. Your cleaner works the entire day with one hour break. So like an eight hour day, a 14 hour day with one hour break. I'm hoping that if I give them a break when they get there too, it gives them some sort of buff as well I've been debating getting a new drum but I've been with this one for a while at this point it just makes me sad to think about letting go maybe we like with the people maybe the job itself people you work with then always like starting a new job can always be really tough right always hard to start a new job Especially when like you have to like, you know, meet a new boss, meet new people. It could make it, it could be a worse situation, but it could also be a better situation. It's always a roll of the dice, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. This should get us to 500. This new hit. And once it does, oh baby. Well, we would want a thousand. We want two workers. I'm gonna lay off on hire or not. I'm gonna wait on hiring a cleaner. And I'm gonna. Wow. I don't know who I should hire first a cleaner or an engineer. I just got an auto save there. 6 a.m. to 1900. Okay. So that many hours with one break and they're still good. Okay. So we should be fine then with seven hours straight. And then what I'll do is I'll put the, I'll put cleaners on the same, like launder morning or launder early and launder uh, late. Come on, come on. 400. Okay, there's the 500. Do I hire the person now? Uh, I mean. Ooh. 
ho, 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 ho. Okay. Uh, let me save. I'm going to turn off auto save. Okay. It's almost 6 a.m. So that would mean we would open. I'm beelining. I don't really even know what that means. I'm sending everybody to the laundromat right now. And I'm going to hire the morning guy right away. We're just going to go full, like full into it. We're just going to dive head first. Workers. Uh, launder early. All of that. Make sure to hit your tasks. And then fingers crossed. Hope for the best. Full send. There you go. It's a full send. Okay, there's our there's our person. That was fast. Goodness gracious. <laughs> what, were you walking down the street and I said, oh, you're hired? Okay. Now we got to get these mopeds back ASAP. ASAP, ASAP, ASAP. I guess in the meantime... Um, oh, wait. We don't have one star. Oh, shoot. We need a star. I think we need a star. Accessible customer toilet. We should get a star for that. It's right there. Unless that was a staff one I accidentally put. Oh my God. Really? Do we get a star now? No, 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 no. If that's not accessible, I don't know what is. <laughs> I, 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 and that's already about to break. Wonderful. Great start. I got the cannabis in the back, lady. The moped's here. What the hell is he doing? Oh, okay. You have a sink? Need a toilet? There should be... There's a toilet right here, right? Do I need a hand dryer? Is that what I need? I need a hand dryer? Oh, yeah, I needed a hand dryer. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Really? Ay, ay, ay. Whatever, dude. Hey, Rachel. How you doing, Rachel? What's going on? You need a hand dryer. Okay, I'm going to reject that politely. $10 there. That's good passive income. Legitimate income. The only crappy thing is, is that I'm really going to need to get an engineer in. Engineers cost $750. What are you doing? Why are you... You're, you're an idiot. You're an actual idiot. That's a customer right there. He's crying. Why? What are you doing? Wait, wait, wait. What you, you're mad because you can't go that way. You're, you're mad. You went, Go out the door. What are you doing? Okay. Engineer is now available. This guy's an idiot. The AI pathing. Oh my God. Help me. Hey, okay, you are here. You are going to work engineer shift. Oh my God. We're in it. We are making money now, baby. We're in it to win it. 365. Oh, that's hot money. That's hot money. <laughs> I don't feel bad for this crying ass guy right here. That's your fault, dude. Just walk out the door. That's all you got to do. That's all you got to do. Walk out the door. You moved to Tennessee, Rachel. Oh, very well. How are you liking it in Tennessee? Is it, is it nice? Yeah. Okay. Engineer should be here. I think engineer should be here in the evening. 
I forgot what the schedule looks like. Engineer, what's the engineer hours? Or yeah, 1600. He should be here at, be here at 1600. They're gonna break, but that's fine. 1600. Oh, dude, this is a wonderful. This is a. This is a climax. Have you ever seen that? Have you ever felt that? This is it right here. I'm feeling good. This is the dopamine kicking in. This guy is such a whiny little bitch. I tell you, oh my God. All right. One thing I'm going to need to do, and I should do it already. Uh, cleaners. We're going to hire cleaners here. So let's do that. Cleaners. We'll hire two. Uh... Launder late. That's fine. And then launder early. Launder early. There we go. We have two stars now. Hooray! Make sure this place is clean. All right. You live next to Dollywood? Oh, very good. Have you gone to Dollywood yet? I want to go to Dollywood sometime. I, I, I just want to experience it. Okay. Oh, 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 right, 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 right. Oh, frick, frick, frick. Um, okay. Uh, oh, shoot. Um. Okay. I forgot we only had a worker for the morning time. So we need a worker for the evening time. I need $500. Uh, do we have any any things on the map? No. Okay. I'm gonna have to wait until I get a, a, a phone call or a hotline. I gotta wait for a hotline. I gotta wait for a hotline. There's our engineer. Gosh darn it, dude. I'm like $70 away. Can I just, you know what? Can I just sell this real quick? Can I just sell this? There we go. We'll just sell the toilet real quick. That's a lot of money sitting there that we're losing out on. Okay, this is launder early or launder late. Sorry, launder late. Yes. There we go. And then we'll just rebuy the um, the bathroom. Come on, buddy! Come on! Come on! Come on! Oh shoot! You need tasks. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! <laughs> go. There you go. Sell it. Sell it. Sell it. Sell it. Okay. There we go. We're back to business. We're back in business. We're back, baby. We're back. <laughs> this customer needs to like politely F off. All right. Are we closed? Yeah, we are now technically closed. Okay. So with our hours being closed, you know what? I'll just load up. I'll load up. I won't load up. I'm loading up. I'm loaded up. I'll load that up. And since we don't have anybody working the nighttime, we will tell all these nopeds to go. Oh crap. Where do we want to go? Tell them to go to the uni. We'll load up the uni. And then um, if a cell comes up, we'll do a cell too. Wow. My face is gone. All right, I'll split it up. I'll put two going to delivery, two going to uh, uni until morning time. I got to at least have a little bit of money to like, you know, keep me above. Did I tell him to go away? Like, shoo, why don't bother me? 
You know? Do fly! I guess in the meantime, we can watch. Uh, actually, you know what? You you need to go. Can you go? Wait a sec. I thought we told you to go somewhere. Where are you at? You're on Oak Lane? Uh, my good man. I need you to just go there. Get that out of there. There you go. Perfect. Everybody, don't go to the laundromat right now. Laundromat is off limits at the moment. Until morning time. Crying little girl. Uh, here you go. Oh, I hit the wrong button. See what you're making me doing, man. Look what you've done. Look at you. You're disgusting. You sit there and you cry. I don't even have $25 to replace it. Ay, ay, ay. I put a hole in my place. I need $25. Look at you. You're pathetic. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, party. I can't click it? Oh shoot. Okay, there we go. Party. Uh University. Okay, go there. No more university. Okay, I think a customer just shit himself in my laundromat. He has. Oh my lord. A customer has died in my laundromat. I don't want to say he deserved it. That guy deserved it. He absolutely deserved it. That's his fault and his fault only. Look at me. It's almost 6 a.m. I got to get these mopeds back out here. Lord have mercy. Okay. Factory, where are you? You're going back to the factory? Okay, good. You're done there. Head over to there when you're done. Where are you going? You're going to the factory? No, you're going to the laundromat now. University man, you're going to the laundromat. Dylan, when you're done doing that, Go to the laundromat. Dylan? Laundromat. Not there. Okay. Everybody, are we good? Can't. I, 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 I wish. I wish upon a star. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. All right. Everybody should be good to go. We should all be back going to laundromat now, right? Are we back? Are we back? I think we're back. We're back. We back, baby. We're back, baby. All right. Look at my look at like my employee walks in and he's like, "There's someone dead behind the counter." Where do I work at? It was this, this was the guy you left in the store when you locked up the shop. He died because you couldn't let him out the door. Apparently, the the gentleman couldn't even jump over the counter. People are gonna come in and see a dead body. But they're gonna be fine because they're still gonna buy oregano from me, so I don't care. There you go. Perfect. You want soap? You got soap. You want cannabis? I got your cannabis right here. You want more cannabis? Hang on while he does that. You want cannabis? How you like them apples? There you go. Now the money starts to come in. This is gonna be a grand day. No hiccups. No interruptions, but just a dead body off to the side. We can all ignore that. We can all ignore that. Holy hell. My goodness gracious. Ask in the glory, shall we? <laughs> Ask in the glory, shall we? Oh my lord. Ah, oh, eighteen hundred dollars. Yeah, this is wonderful. Great day. And then I guess the next thing would be like upgrading, uh, purchasing an upgrade and things like that. That would be fun. Okay, we are out of the cannabis. I'm so sorry. 
How many points did I get? I got 54 points at the scrapyard? When the heck did I get that? <laughs> Holy crap, dude. All right. Well, that's going to help us with our heater, I guess, if we wanted to do that. Lord have mercy. Wow. I'm, in, I'm slightly impressed. $2,500. Beep, beep. Now I could have another register here and I could have another worker one work in the register one work in the boxes coming in But you know what? I don't think we need it. I think we're fine. I think we're doing just fine Three thousand dollars. We could buy an upgrade if we wanted to for this laundromat, but we're good We're good, baby There you go I'm feeling really good. Let me save this son of a gun Turn this back on to five minutes <laughs> All right. Are we in the evening time yet? This is like a full day here, right? Just about. All right. There we go. I don't know where to spend my, my money next. Actually, now that we have a lot of money coming in, I think now... Well, yeah. Well, I could have a night person in. Someone storing the boxes in the nighttime. I think that's what I'm going to do next. Okay. So what we're going to do next is we're going to create a schedule for laundromat night. This will be launder night. And this will be uh, 20 hundred. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There we go. This will be a launder night. And all this guy does is comes in and gets boxes during the nighttime. That's it. That's, that's, that's the job. That's all you have to do. That's, that's your job. That's all you got to do. That's your launder night. Boxes only. Launder night. And we'll have these, um, we'll have the mopeds continue coming in through the night too. And then what I'm going to do now is I'm going to switch over to, uh, this noped number one. We'll just choose it. Noped number one. We will change your color to red and you will be going out of laundromat and you will be going to the university now. So we'll have three mopeds continuously going to the laundromat, one moped going to the, uh, university. So that we can get toasted in and we can get, get to the next level. Yeah, that's where it is. Yeah, that's what it is. That's a good. I, I, I like that. Yeah. Hey, Grandma Miki. How are you? Good to see you. I hope you're doing well. And we'll do that. And that should be a okay. Right. Right. Uh, the only thing maybe I need to do is like add a couple more shelves just in case a couple more storage shelves in here there we go that should that should be fine that should be fine we're sitting comfortable comfortably 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 i want to save <laughs> we're sitting comfortably now what time is this are we still in business hours we are still in business hours so we're still selling baby good 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 we're still selling and then eventually maybe I'll hire more people to have like a register person and a, and a stalker person. But right now during the day, it's fine if they're doing both. I think 4,100 the first time we hit 4,000 and actually it's the first time we hit 4,000 or had 4,000 since we bought the license. So I guess early game, if you were to kind of break it down a bit, it is possible if done correctly and efficiently. It is possible to have the hotline make you enough profit to where you can buy into the laundromat. So we've learned that today. That's what's good for sure. Oh yeah. Speed shoes, speed shoes for the night. I think speed shoes, maybe just across the board for everybody. Uh, but yeah, let's get some speed shoes going. Is there anything else I can give you worthwhile? I think speed shoes is it. Give you a hat.
Ah, free shoes is it. There you go. Have fun with that. Buddy, is this night shift? Okay, this is night shift. So we can see it actually in full motion here. All right, go outside, grab that. Go inside, do that. Wait, that's all you do all day. You have the easiest job. <laughs> Honestly, it doesn't get any easier than that. Take a look at this. Good. Now we can get uh, cannabis, uh, toasted cannabis. We have unlocked toasted cannabis now. If we go to scrapyard, if we need to, we can buy upgraded heaters, air cons, those things. Hallelujah. This is a good day. Improved cannabis cutting bench. I would like to do that probably next. Maybe even get an auto cannabis cutting bench. Maybe a better drying rack. I would like to probably do those things. I think working on the product is probably the best thing we could do for ourselves. Yeah. With that being said, I'm going to go ahead and pause it there, save it there, and that's where we're going to stop it in today's live stream of Definitely Not Fried Chicken, the full release 1.0. If you enjoyed this, please make sure to hit the like button if you want to see more. Hitting the like button, commenting down below if you're watching this in the VOD, tells me you want to see more of Definitely Not Fried Chicken, and I'll continue this empire that we have here. So just let me know and all that good stuff. Thank you for all the generous people today. Thank you, Floatery V, for the five gifted memberships. Uh, Jennifer Wynn. Uh, for the super chat Tanya for the super chat as well all the people that re-up their membership thank you for all the people that read up their memberships I appreciate it Darren for the five gifted memberships uh Savvy Tech with the 10 gifted memberships massive 10 gift bombs stay space with the super chat Lizzie for becoming a member for the first time and Lizzie with the super chat and Zari's with the super chat as well thank you all for hanging out with me today it's been a pleasure if you didn't catch my earlier stream today I streamed Thief Simulator 2, so you can check that out that we did earlier today and all that good stuff. I will be streaming again tomorrow to continue other series we have you on the, here on the channel. Hopefully you all have a wonderful evening, wonderful day, and thank you for spending your time with me because spending your time is a valuable time, and spending your valuable time me, with me is a pleasure and honor. Have a good one. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and all that good stuff, and I'll talk to you all tomorrow. Do take care.